Jeez. Don't cry. Alright, I'm good. Let me see I got enough book. Make sure I got some boosts. Yeah, we good. You want McDonald's? You want McDonald's? French fry? I don't care what you eat, do you? Or nuggets? Say nuggets? You sleepy? <laughs> so they got a whole bunch of lockdowns. Game started. Ah, oh, shit, I can't get back. <laughs> yeah, I, had to, I also saw you about to do that wild when I told him to get out of this. We got a 98 standard dunk. God! <laughs> I didn't see that guy. We got a 98 standard dunk. We got a couple. I'm good, but I didn't get mad because we had I don't care about no bullshit. Yeah, I'm good. I'll switch it next. I'll switch it next. play.
I ain't been on this build in a minute. <laughs> so you want to see or not? Uh, what we at? What we at? What we at? Do that shit again, Frank. You gotta shoot down <laughs> level. <laughs> you shoot it. Yeah, level. nah. He he was he was looking for the corner. I seen it, and they tapped the ball. He he kind of. Down a fucking delay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. He was trying to get that off. That's crazy. Free throw line with no mid range. Taking that shit. Oh, 
Oh shit. Oh god. Everything's slightly late. See behind this tree. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Look like Frank did be having fun out there. <laughs> Oh, 
Come on, bro. Fuck. I really hate new changes. Don't shoot them dogs with that gun. Enough people to he could at least got fouled in that possession. I'm waiting to get. I'll, I gotta get my fucking interior to get it. That shit ain't done. <laughs> I learned. I was, I was going to try to get Nelson in the corner one time. I said, nah. Stay, stay, stay. Back up, back up, back up. 
That is tough. I didn't even have a Where are you going, Sean? I saw the same thing the last play. I was like, if I had to pass it, I'd just lob it up. Cut through all that traffic. That pick was terrible. You want me to go on? Sure. You gotta go out the center. I'm about to say you got yeah. The float, the float oh is the... God, he's past the suck! <laughs> Just wanna throw it out there. Get the center, Sean.
Oh, I get it now. Losing it, man. I play like shit. What's wrong, bro? Oh, my bad. The show went off. All right, the top, bro. Easy. That's a quick bit. How tall your beard is? Six nine. Six nine. Nah. We're done. Oh. oh yeah, yeah. We did. Uh, damn, I had to just retire. Nah, that 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 was getting too weird, bro. It was getting annoying. You said what? It was, it was just, it was, bro, it was 25 straight runs to the left. I was like, bro, I get it. I went to the left and he motioned to the right. <laughs> I put a control down after that. You got it, bro. It's just important to you, bro. You got it. I told him, I said, bro, I'll let you get, I said, bro, I'll let you get the dub. I, I, I'll let you go up by 20. Just once you go by 20, bro, can we, can we play? 
Like, can we play oh, that's wow. Like... Mine's on got no three. Gave yeah, well, up what? Huh? Talking about the minoxidil? What you using? Biotin? Oh shit. I've been getting heavy into the skincare shit. Can't shoot this shit. That's all. That's crazy. So <laughs> they put the ball on them. <laughs> that nigga said the pastrami posse. Nigga said white white boy could hang out with us at the park. White boy wanted to be around us with the Cadillacs. Where your Cadillac at, white boy? <laughs> you couldn't hang out with us at the park, white boy. It's gonna <laughs> save your life. Where you should be at, white boy. He <laughs> really jumped in that shit, though. I'm surprised Rick Ross jumped in that shit. Drake called him out. You got your got that BB on your nose, white boy. <laughs> this for anybody that had a six pack and now they gotta cover it up. <laughs> oh shit. Ah. I saw, uh, who that, Dalen, that, that's you, uh, who like, uh, Lupe? He trying Moses. to jump in it, too. Oh, that's Moses. Okay, okay. It's I battle any fucking rapper. I said, what the fuck Lupe got to do with this shit? Lupe would do with that, though, because he beef with Royce of 5-9. Royce of 5, okay. I just didn't understand, uh, J. Cole. He, I, that, that shit threw me for a loop right there. Yeah, it was. <laughs> he called him up. I just never seen that happen. I never seen nobody bow out of a, a rap out. He bowed out without even getting the response. It's different if somebody like hit you back and then you like, yo, I lost. He quit before he even lost. He didn't give losing a, losing a chance. But he a middle child. <laughs> he wants that smoke. <laughs> but he always asking for it. Every song, any rapper that mm -hmm. wanted with me, always asked for it. So I thought he was he was the first to respond, but damn, he just tapped out fast as fuck. I just think this, the, I, I don't think he really had anything to say to Kendrick, and that's what made it hard. 
Yeah, it was like oh. It was like first, we're really friends, and then the shit I'm calling you out about is like the one thing you do well. Like he was like calling out for his album. I'm like, well, that's the one thing Kendrick really does have is his album. Like, he's one of the few people from that new school that still puts out legit albums. The track one matters. The track eleven. Even if you don't like what he's saying, like the quality of the album, you always like he, he's giving you an album. It's not no rush project. It's not no, you know, random stuff with just thirty-five different features. Like he really gives you an album with a concept every time. Yeah. Most we really just be throwing music to, together. It really just be mixtapes. Like Rick Ross, like like Rick Ross really puts out albums. He puts out albums, yeah. It was I. That's what I. I think that's what I was like even telling with Germ the other day and Josh, because we were in here and they were talking about um, Rick Ross, like, but Rick Ross ain't had no hits until Drake. I was like, y'all really believe Rick oh, Ross ain't had no on, hits man. until Drake? <laughs> he have no number one. So you said Rick Ross have no hits though? No, like, Rick Ross has had a hit since his first album. His first album, yeah. Yeah, but Drake gave him number one. I don't like care about that shit until Drake. I don't like care about all this until Drake started having accolades. Ah, oh, my bad, friend. Because the number ones is a pop thing. Like, hip hop was never number ones unless you had, like, that really, really song. Like, Drake does it in streaming there. I'm like. Yeah, but we know Rick Ross pushing it and all the other songs are still hustling, all that was still you, mm -hmm. BMF. Live fast, die young, like, yeah, but when he said that, I was like, he was like, but Drake gave him all his hits. I was like, oh, y'all really, like, this is, but that's why I, I, I realized with the comments with the Drake fans, I'm like, a lot of the Drake fans aren't really fans of hip hop. And that's why, like, he gets away, he gets away with everything in the arguments. Yeah, that's true. Cause they just, they just showed that Lil Yachty wrote that, uh, that one song, Frank, that you like, the, uh, the one you yeah. said sound like Young Thug. I saw that shit. <laughs> the if I pull a minute, no minute. Mm, 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 mm. Hold on. Yeah, I heard that too. It's a whole, like, it's literally Lil Yachty ghost wrote it. Metro Boomin leaked the shit. Yeah. And but it's like it doesn't matter. So and that's what's the problem with and that's why I even tell a journey the other day he was like, You want Kendrick to win? I was like, I don't think Kendrick could win. I don't think you can beat Drake. I don't think he could beat I don't think you can beat Drake because half the niggas don't they don't care about anything. They don't. I'm like, it, it, you can't win in a battle if they don't care about the rules. <laughs> like, I don't, I don't care if Drake did this. I don't care if Drake did that. I don't care if Drake did this. Like, oh, so <laughs> Drake is bad. Yeah. It's not about persuading because. I'm a Meek Mill fan, but I can say, yo, Drake won. I'm saying, like, the way that this is going with this, this, uh, with Drake shit is like, yo, it's like, you can't beat Drake because the niggas that are, you can't beat Drake fans because Drake fans don't care about hip hop. So it's like you're having a hip hop battle, and they're like, I don't care that Drake didn't write his own hit. Beyonce didn't. And it's like, oh, God. We're they, 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 I they, saw. They I saw. Kinda, that somebody said that shit too. It was yeah, like the female. The females don't give a fuck star. if he write if he write his lyrics. Yeah, they look at him. As, <laughs> right. Yeah. So that's what, like you can't you can't beat can't this beat nigga him. because most of his fans. He's the he's the the our y'all generation of LL Cool J. Like it's Nelly, really? Because Nelly, even LL Cool J still wrote it. Yeah, yeah, LL Cool J was, was yeah. That's yeah, that's true. And, Probably and more that's Nelly. Saying, like, it makes it hard with the conversation because I'm like. But he, you know, L was like pop star. But L, if you, you, if you, you fuck with L, I don't care. I don't 
care who you are a fan of with the Jay-Z versus Nas stuff when they came out. If somebody like leaked that Jay-Z had seven songs that he didn't write. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's, it's it's it, it, that's it. I don't care how hard Takeover or Ether is like, yo, now nah, you. I was in! Sean did it. I don't know. Sean did it. My son did it. My son did it. Oh, my, oh, that wasn't you, Frank. Oh, yo, yeah, look, look, Sean hit that. He snapped the control out of my hand. Yeah, dirty dude. But, yeah, I'm like. I don't give a damn what song you drop. I don't give you drop back to back or anything. Yeah, I'd be hurt, bro. Came out and said, "Yo, this nigga ain't write a song," and then they and then went on flex and chill quit mill. I'm like, "Oh, that's a L." Not not by Drake rules. I'm like, "Yeah, you can't lose." I'd be hurt if if I if I ever heard a a sample track from DMX or the Locks, I'd be hurt, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Push it, push a T, push a T. Posted the cover with Drake doing uh what blackface. Blackface, yeah. And that wasn't enough. <laughs> like, <Graves> I. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> Yo, my man, my man said you since you brought up my Beyonce, let's break up. Yo, since you brought up my fiance, let's look at who you chose to be your Beyonce. I was like, yo. <laughs> But you can't beat him though. It's like yo, you cannot. That man, that man went on a on a on a podcast with LeBron and said, "You can't let me down." LeBron said, "You can't let me down." <laughs> but you can't cancel Kanye because Kanye is is dope. But you can't. You can't kill Kanye because Kanye's dope. You can't kill Drake because Drake is really not from the culture. Nah, so he's not he, playing by our rules. Yeah, and his fans are just like him. Suburban people that aren't from our culture. So it's like, yeah, we're not even competing on the... But I would say seventy percent of his fans are females. A big, a big portion of the Drake fans that like the fans, not not the I like. But Rod, Rodney also named his child Aubrey. Rodney also had <laughs> gauges in his ear. Rodney, <laughs> he has came out and stated that he named his son. I thought I was right. <laughs> oh shit. Rodney, <laughs> Rodney, I never really paid attention until he stated that I'm named. Rodney is all. Rodney, y'all do. I mean, J <laughs> Daylin, like Rodney's Rodney's favorite rapper before Drake was Eminem. Like Rodney is, even though he yeah, he came from the same hood, he that's not his life. Like Rodney is chilling. I'm talking about. I'm talking about from really from our culture, bro. The people that really grew up listening to hip hop. Rodney didn't grow up listening to hip hop. Rodney's favorite rapper was literally Eminem. Ain't that hip hop? Ain't that it hip -hop? is hip hop. But if 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 a black guy if the black guy says his favorite rapper is Eminem, you know the other kind yeah. of music he listens to. You know exactly what else he's listening to. <laughs> yeah. So you know, yeah. Like Eminem like, can't be. Matt Miller. You know exactly. Right. Unless he tied the, unless to. you say he tied the fifty cent, you say, you know he, he uh, yeah, because I'm like, bro, mm. he, yeah, he, like, he you know exactly, you know exactly <laughs> what else he's listening to if he says that's his number one. Yeah, nah. I mean, who else is a big Drake fan in here? I'm Karen. not a big. I don't know. Not from the culture, not from the culture. <laughs> not from the culture, not from the culture. What, what does that mean? What does it, huh? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> we went to school with a lot of people from different demographics. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> We're not. Well, damn, it's just a point guard. 
Josh had a conversation uh, what two weeks ago about y'all with Kanye and said I don't listen to Kanye. Lloyd had Lloyd had a conversation about Jay Z and said I don't really listen. I just started listening to Jay Z. His old, nigga said his old album was really dope. I said well, yeah we was having conversations you never heard of. I know I get it. We were having debates about somebody you didn't listen to, but that's what I'm saying. Like that's. But that's the culture, bro. Hip hop. Where does hip hop come from, Daylon? It comes from New York. It comes from New York. <laughs> like, it comes First from there. <laughs> like you can't do that without doing that. And you have to pick a side too. Which is what? what yeah. But you, even when you, even when you hear these these young niggas, even when you hear these young niggas that are rappers now, and they say they didn't listen, they didn't listen to the to the young niggas. They didn't. Li I don't listen to JD Kids. I don't listen to that. It's like, oh yeah, I get it. Alright. When I heard uh what's his name? Uh Offset say they was the best rap group ever. I was like, All right, bro. I don't know. Yeah, and that's what I'm like, it's, like... It's, a, it's it's a culture thing, bro. It's it is what it is. Nah, you got you got to give you got to pay homage. I, mean, I, bro. I do I do think you got to have like if you know rap groups, there's no reason Migos should stay there even close to the. They're even close. They're not even in the. I don't even know, bro. You mob deep, Pony Noriega. I mean, just, like, I mean, I mean just, just off the Outcast alone. Outcast. I mean, just my. I mean, a goodie mob. It's so many before. But I'm I'm saying like oh, even yeah. just even even the moment that Outcast. I mean, okay. yeah, in y'all generation, but I'm saying if you're gonna say we're the best rap group ever, and I'm like, cause, I, just because yeah. just because this is our generation, don't mean that we don't have to know our history. Like we, we don't have to be those like he those didn't even say that just don't know music. <laughs> he didn't even say NWA. He was like, oh yeah, NWA too. I was like, damn, nigga, like <laughs> they started it. I was like, oh, okay, All right. but I mean, I'm not saying that. that just the fact that Outkast is a group should stop that conversation because it's like they went diamond twice in the South, like before the South was like that. That niggas was still, big. Niggas still want a three stats verse. Niggas listen to a flute. Niggas listen to a flute. I, I get that up. You listen to the flute. <laughs> I did. I, He said, listen to it in the shower. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, roll out. Right. All right, that's my fault. I fucked that play. I, I fucked that I think play. Migos a dope group. I think they're a good group, but I don't, I can't give him, I can't give him the best. The, the fact that Migos came out of Atlanta and said that they're the greatest group of all time when they're not even the greatest group out of Atlanta. Out of Atlanta, I'm like, come they're on. They're not even the best out of Atlanta. I couldn't call that. Who's on the was Shay Shay? The nigga over here talking about Migos, the best group. He not even a part of Migos. Ain't even no Migos no more. <laughs> it was only two left and one of them dead. It, that's a, I, what do you say, oh God, that's a true statement. It's only, it's only two. <laughs> they, nah. they kick, they kick Offset out five years ago. Yes, they kicked him out five years ago. It's 2024 now. He got kicked out in COVID. I'm sorry, 2004 years ago. He got kicked out during COVID. Ah, oh, shit. That's what went to Frank. Yeah, man. Take off died two years ago. It ain't even Amigos. And then Offset was in jail for two of the years that they was out in Statesboro and in the net. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, oh, come so on. Naked, baby. Making me a wife. It wasn't the first time I met Lil Mine. She was a one ninety. Hell no. I'm the type. 
Oh, oh, nigga, that hoe was Michael. She don't want me no freak no more. I don't want no money get giggly. <laughs> and I ain't putting that over Rosa Park any day. <laughs> oh, I you talking about I No Levels too? The best out mixtape I ever heard? <laughs> <laughs> nah, No Levels too. <laughs> And I still ain't putting that over bombs over Baghdad, Rosa Parks, none of it. Quinn and I, none of it. I apologize. I mean, if you lie to Outcast versus Migos, I'm sorry for you, brother. Do it, I, had, please. I had to get past NWA over me. He was wide open. I can't, I can't make passes any better. <laughs> nah, nah, bro. I, I'm, I'm, I've been shooting bad, so I just been. I was just going to. Floated. You talking about Migos? The birds! P -p birds! <laughs> birds take a bath! <laughs> that's, that's my song right there. The birds! I'm not a, I'm not against the Migos. They just well, gotta I, I get, get their props. I, I, I get that's the future right one. The, I get future because I'm like, yo, future been out for. Future been out all legit for all over what? Like 15 years now? I'm like, I get it if future wanna say you something about something. Yeah, but y'all, like, you say things like you say things like solid, Come and then you say outcast, and then that's the problem. The problem is not the catalog. <laughs> the problem is. It's five albums deep. You still got the Dungeon Family. I mean, that birth outcast. Like, you got his. When, the Dungeon Family, not, Birth, the Outcast, that, Goody Mob. The problem is not that the problem is not that when niggas are saying, <laughs> I, I mean, uh, Migos are bad or Migos is this. The problem is that niggas say things like, "Yo, we're the greatest group," and I'm like, "Fam, y'all ain't made out of Atlanta yet." I'm not afraid. They ain't made it out of Atlanta yet. Like you, you can't say that if you can't even compete with the group. <laughs> Ooh, you know me go versus outcast right. versus you lose that every day. Uh, I ain't gonna, <laughs> I, I don't know, it's only no levels two over here. I ain't gonna play no other songs. Uh, <laughs> you got bad and booze you, one of the niggas ain't on it. <laughs> Who's that got left out by booze? Versace, I guess. Huh? <laughs> Versace, I think it's pretty tough. You got fight night. She it's don't want to be a freak no more. <laughs> and then you got niggas that got hey y'all, so fresh, so clean, clean, Miss Jackson. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Rosa Parks. <laughs> <laughs> niggas gonna be turn. Niggas gonna be turned. Stir back fry, pretty, no stir fry, stir fry, is pretty dude. hot. Nobody care about no big boy and, and Andre. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all trolling at this point. That is the wildest thing I've ever heard. The nigga I thought, just, I thought the Stir Fry was okay. A flute album because that man made an album. <laughs> First of all, I was never going to listen to a flute album. <laughs> That's cool. You did. You said nobody. <laughs> <Don't worry. laughs> you didn't catch that double hot tantra? <laughs> Mode of sport, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas ain't got enough I like the way you move. <laughs> Fuck a that's what happened. That shit was crazy. Oh, man. Yeah. But that don't beat the art of storytelling. Nothing. Yeah. Lake Rich. <laughs> like, they not being I like the way you move. These ain't even dull songs either. These are like shit that actually get people moving. Man, they do A big boy in Andre 2000. I could never. <laughs> That nigga Nelson said, Nelson I like Big Boy too. Because Nelson said that he only got I, one take. Frank, the only person I've ever heard say that. I, I, <laughs> I, 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 Big Boy, I like Big Boy. <laughs> the nigga Nelson said they got one take. 
<laughs> hey, bro, you, you, every song got no labels too. I'm here for it. that nigga. Never said I give you one album. <laughs> they better not, they better not leave from that album. <laughs> the bird. Oh, square. Got that. Niggas, niggas went diamond, bro. In Atlanta. Niggas went diamond in Atlanta in the 90s, bro. You know what else we had in the 90s? Pastor Troy. <laughs> when New Orleans niggas was making music in Atlanta, them niggas went diamond. Them niggas went, them niggas went diamond when Tupac and Biggie was, and Lauryn Hill was making music. Oh yeah. I'm sorry. Damn, bro. I forgot about the Fugees. <laughs> yeah. I'm not giving to the Fuji. Black Eyed I'm, I'm, I, they did lead too early, but it was just so many groups. They led Black Eyed, Black Eyed Peas. I mean, Migos, Migos can make a case against the Fugees. I know, and that's it. It was so. I mean, we talking about catalog. You said one thing. All right, fam. I can name more than three classics. Outkast got like twenty. I ain't gonna be, I'm not gonna be that old nigga, bro, that's saying Outkast can't beat the food. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna do that one. Uh, like, yeah, I get it. Just yeah, all, bro, I get it. Sport, Ready bro. or not, here I come. You can't hide, bro. We get it. <laughs> but, like I said, Daly, you still got Run DMC. Still got Bone Thugs. <laughs> Damn, yeah, Bone Thugs, Run, man, there's so many, man. <laughs> Didn't they you lose? Still, they ain't even in the top, they ain't even in the top 10, man. Yeah, you still got a Tribe Called Quest. You still got Wu-Tang. Wu-Tang, oh, shit. Hey, I mean, hey, 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 hey. He hey, said Wu-Tang don't count. Man. Hey, Todd, hey, hey, man, stop showing your age, bro. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, man, I'm sorry, <laughs> man. He was like, Wu-Tang, oh, that's, shit. That's that, <laughs> that school bus music, man. That's that, sh that's that CD player three, Walkman music, man. You still got three six mafia. Rough Riders, come on. <laughs> and I don't even know if Rough Riders was a group. Bro, every time he said something, all the... Every man, every group you said a nine, he was like, oh, oh, oh yeah, man, might, might have to pull out the CD player, man. You got the locks, you got Dipset, like, come on now. I hope your CD player don't work. It got scratched. Nah, I ain't even got no CD player, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they been being being real. Top the ten, they ain't even in the top to ten, man. Hope you don't I have think, no alcohol either. Being real, I think, <laughs> I think a good, I think a good back and forth is Migos versus Dipset. Dipset, Dipset. Yes. They do make the same kind of music. I'm about to say they. Uh, yeah. Nah, try calls quest. I wouldn't put them in there with them. No. Well, the locks. I nah, I wouldn't put the locks in there with them. Um. I think Dipset made the same type of up tempo music. I think Dipset probably be the closest. Can I kick it? Yes, you can. Everybody off? I'm not. Still here. To my label, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> Daily, you on? I think uh, top of top of drop. <clears throat> I don't see him in the uh, top of scroll. drop. Top 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 of drop. Who you got? Are ah, you good? Let me go do my shooting. Uh, at the, I need to get some shots up. I ain't played. That baby be a center and a fucking. One thing I would say: once you go to six ten, the shooting is different. Six ten and seven, I think, like a little Wimby build, but that the shooting is different. That shit is, but I'm like, I don't even know if I even want to play with. <laughs> but they good though. But it's like shit. But that that. 
<clears throat> that shooting is just different. Seven one. And then you come back down to a guard, the shot a lot of faster. It's, just, it's much faster. Oh, I got it. <laughs> he said so much anxiety. Bag it. <laughs> Bag it. <laughs> Oh, I, I only, that's how it is with me, one life. I only go to one life now, like, 10 a.m., or I just go to, or uh, on the weekend. I'll be like, bro, I'm so used to going to that gym where it's just me. Like, yeah. I go to one. They got shit, they got to go to work, yeah. They're like, fuck yeah, you going at peak hours. Stop my bad. Oh, he's not even here. I'm supposed to text Lindsay. Nah, Lindsay asked me what I wanted to eat, and then Topper sent me a text, and I responded saying wings. <laughs> so he probably just like, bro, what the fuck is this nigga talk about? You got it like that. That was perfect. Great job. That was a reward, bro. This shit turned into destiny or some shit. You could just look cool. It's Fortnite, bro. Yeah, they kind of getting. They need them fix the shit. Keeping old, shit. just keeping old Fortnite. Fortnite. Yo, MP, what are you doing just standing there? Hit the courts. <laughs> MP, you gotta keep showing up, bro. I watched a, I watched a game earlier that's on my YouTube. It was me, you, Frank, and Jason in the my court. Oh, but yeah, that was basketball. Yo, MP, I was hoping I'd run into you. I went. Niggas don't even got my courts no more. Yo, MP, if I were you. Oh yeah, you're right. They don't have. Nah, not on this. Not on this. Two K, nah. Two K, two K down. Two K down, bro. I think Madden, Madden sales are up. Okay, yeah, Madden sales are up. College football gonna wipe all this shit out. Mm -hmm. But college football is gonna boost. College. I mean, they're in the basketball games. Yeah, it ain't no other football game. Two. But Madden, but. But 2K, I mean, but NCAA is going to boost Madden sales also. Yeah, it's going to boost it. The NBA started partnering with specific companies. Yeah, they got the license to this shit. You, can't, you can yeah. have it, but you can't have the names of the players or the likeness. Yeah, they, they're partnered specifically with these people now. You got to pay them. NBA Live <laughs> fucked up because NBA Live took a break. And let NBA 2K Live get took the that break in, uh, was it, 2K... 13 they took yeah, a break yeah. and fucked it up uh, fucked it up um, <clears throat> so now it's only two sports games you got 2k and match baseball i mean and then you got wrestling ufc hey, it's not the same company yeah for you if you're interested well it may be the show not I thought NBA. that was EA. I mean, Madden or 2K. Nah, MLB the show is uh hold on. I don't know why I thought EA made uh the sh the show. Mm mm. What's going on, coach? I heard it was just MLB and then 2K had their own too. Yeah. 
Because M- yeah, M- MLB the show just came to play, uh, to it's Xbox la- this year or last year because it was even a, it was just a PlayStation thing. It's a Sony. Oh damn! Yeah, I forgot they had Sega. <laughs> Sega Sports too. Mm-hmm. Them well, they got look, it. It's a great day to play pro Deion yeah, Sanders yeah, had that, his that, own that, game. Every, everything partnered with something now. Yeah, I'm walking back in. I just did my. Saying the program jumps the place to be. It's in that land, but. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) Thank you. It's MLB the show is made by Sony. By Sony, okay. Oh, that's wild, though. Yeah, because they just came to Xbox. Damn, I didn't know that. I never got the baseball. Uh, yeah, Sony Interactive Entertainment. But MLB The Show is so much better than 2K Matter. Like, the creations and everything. I need to get on that shit. I even thought about playing hockey. But ML... <laughs> <laughs> I'll say 10. this though, MLB the show is a hard game to uh, play. Yeah, I sent an invite. <laughs> yeah, that does. Yeah. I'm about to. I'll switch. I'll get, yeah, I'll get my say. hybrid out. Like really out there, my nigga. Saying social anxiety. Saying social anxiety and dicks in the same statement is just gay. Who that? Social anxiety and dicks in the same one. Man up, bro. Nigga out here having, nigga out here being scared at the gym. Go lift some weights. I feel you, but it's the gym. Put your headphones on, keep your head up. What? I stopped having. I stopped caring about the gym once I realized everybody in there is struggling. Struggling? Yeah, everybody in the gym is struggling. No matter how strong you is, you're struggling to get to the next one. Like everybody is struggling. I'm not saying what people think about you. I'm saying like once I realized like everybody is locked in on their own thing. I was like, oh, just put the headphones on. Everybody in their own zone. But that's different to me. It is like a different like environment. Like a gym, I'm like, yo, you put your headphones on and let the music play. Do your thing, yeah. Yeah, go on the overpack. You wanted that food, right? I didn't accept the <laughs> squad invite, so there we go. Uh, okay. Frank, accept squad invite. Nelson still here? Still Nelson. Huh? You still here? Or no, you off? Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm out. I'm out. I gotta play center. I'm not doing it. You can I, mean, play I, got, I got a center. He's in the '87, though. But, you know. So me and Dale can play big. I got some decent, decent badges. You I don't, don't, don't want to play. I only play lockdown. So play lockdown. <laughs> wow. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Well, yeah, I did. Once it was just Roddy in here, everybody left. Bro, Caitlin Clark, Caitlin Clark should have took that big, big three contract. Yeah, she should have. 
But don't they season start like in a couple weeks? Would she been have been uh, able to? Th- it's gonna come. I, well, I think yeah. But she's drive. only getting paid. But what Ice Cube was saying like I'll still like you can still play this. We just want you to play a couple games of the Big Three just for marketing. But he's gonna give her five million. She's gonna make in the WNBA seventy five thousand a year. God damn. Yeah. That's, like, that's wild. Like no, he's not. That's wild. That Caitlin Clark about to make Caitlin Clark makes less than me. That's all I'm about to say. Shit, she does not make less than me. I mean, she'll make more on the I mean, her contract. Her contract her yeah, own. but that's what, but yeah, but and that's just like you know endorsement. Same thing Olympic players do at that point. Like yeah, you just go get a day job and just stay in shape. Yeah, because her side hustles is what. That's why they they yeah, they give make all her money off of Gatorade and Nike and everything else. It's like, well, yeah, yeah you she probably won't even won't even spend them down that money. You could have just went to the yeah. She could have just went to the big three. I she was gonna give her five million. She ain't got no choice at this point, right? <laughs> I can definitely see. I can definitely see her and uh, Angel Reese. They're gonna care. really start like actually bringing more people to watch it because they got a narrative going, like how the Magic Larry Bird is. But <laughs> at the end of the day, I don't care how bad WNBA is. They make enough to pay her more than seventy five thousand. Yeah, they're, they're 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 cheap. Like they talk about us as men watching it. Nah, somebody need to relook at that. Uh, they need to record look at that that money. There ain't yeah. no way in hell she only making seventy six thousand. And then they only got twelve teams. That's that is terrible. <laughs> like shit, y'all like. That's cool. Seventy six thousand, only twelve teams. The owners are billionaires. Get that bitch. There's only want. twelve teams. Yeah, yeah twelve teams. So give that bitch whatever she want. I would have gave her. Yeah, I'm about to say we don't have to take the L on this. Cause she gonna bring, she gonna fill seats. Yeah, like that season started May 14th. Like she could have, like she could, she's not gonna make five million over her career. Yeah, for real. Yeah, and that's crazy. You only got twelve teams. You don't even need to. She's not gonna make five million over her career. <clears throat> I'm I'm talking about NBA contracts. Yeah. I know she's going to make more. I'm saying off her NBA contract over the next four years, she's gonna make three hundred and thirty thousand. She ain't playing until she's forty, bro. <laughs> like, and don't let her have a baby. <laughs> That don't include she's she, yeah. that that's why Brittany Griner went overseas. Like, yo, we're if she's making seventy six thousand under the new shit as the number one pick, that means that she's making the most out of the rookies. The other rookies probably making fifty thousand. Damn. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> that motherfucker gotta wash cars or something, bro. This, hey. is one, this is the number one pick that we're talking about, bro. She probably should have went to the NBA, yeah. That. As the last pick, you could have just like at this point you got an agree. <laughs> she would have made yeah uh, as the last pick. I'm not gonna lie to you, like at this point you have you got a degree. You spent four years in college. If I was her, I'd have just did something. Like yeah, let me go actually go get a job and just let me get a job and stay in shape for the Olympics. Because okay. at this point you really doing it for the love of the game. But I think I think she. I like I truly do think, but it's gonna like take that, a minute. Yeah, I think that. They, I don't think it's gonna. I, I think they can actually make some shake. I just don't think that right now, like, it should be the WNBA. Yeah. Whatever they need to rebrand it or do, make it like a little G League under the NBA. Whatever they need to do, cool. But it's like, fam, I don't even think it gotta be Cohen. Like how they redid the G League or something, bro. But you gotta start over. Like Frank said, bro, they've never made a profit. Like that that organ, the company. I, I, 
Like I'm not I'm not talking about women's basketball. I'm saying that's what's it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like I'm not talking about women's basketball. I'm saying the company, the WNBA, just just liquidate. It's all over. Renamed like bro, the team name is the Indi she going to the Indiana Fever. <laughs> like, <laughs> the Atlanta Dream. <laughs> like, oh shit. Get real. <laughs> Be real with y'all. Y'all can name y'all stuff the Tigers. Hit the corner, hit the like, corner, hit the corner. The Lions. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, it was like, get real with yourself. Y'all, they named that damn team the Fever. Like, that's where the number one pick is going to. Oh, you got to cut off that thing. <clears throat> Even the NBA knew, hey, yo, Victor coming out this year. Oh, yeah, yeah they done gave Antonio. him. I, we I like we going to make sure San Antonio get this. We're not letting that nigga go to Charlotte. Yes. That's, that's, right. you got to brand, you got to brand him when he comes out. They, they knew. Sure, hey, yo, yo, we got... You they knew. What? I don't know. It's a branch of the NBA. It's got. Yes. Because being real, and David Stern too, them niggas say, yo, we got this LeBron James kid coming from Ohio. Who will get number one pick? Ohio. We're going to make this nigga the savior. <laughs> <laughs> He was the savior, and now San they Antonio, doing they doing it with Wimby. San Antonio has had three. Every time they've had the number one pick, they've had a generational big man in the draft. There ain't no Ooh. damn surprise. That nigga Victor Wimbyama could have he could have went to Houston, and he could have went to Charlotte. Oof. He could have went to Houston and Charlotte, and they said, "Fuck no." Ah, uh, no. He would have got in so much trouble. Ah, <clears throat> uh. bro, you gotta think about it. Atlanta had Luca. <laughs> like, yeah, they could have got. They took Trey. No, they they, they could have they did get them. They they drafted them. Yeah, they traded. They actually, tra yeah, they traded them. That's what I'm saying. Like they said, nah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Mark Cuban got all the first dibs. Like. Bro, I mean, in sports, like, we know the shit don't be making. Even when I was watching, I mean, in football, I'm like, yo, wait, Stephon uh -huh. Diggs got, went to Houston for. Yeah, I, now, yeah, I had let him go to you. I wasn't I'm like, yo, try Stephon to... Diggs went to Houston for a what? <laughs> for a oh, second yeah. round pick, and then they got back a fourth and a fifth? Like, damn. Yeah, they got that boy some help. They know he's the future. I, I said, I was like, bro, it's crazy, bro. That you draft the qu right quarterback, and literally they was like, yo, CJ Stroud with the play. Hey, yo, give him, give him Stephon Diggs. Mm-hmm. Be the future. He got Stephon Diggs for a second. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Down. And and they got to take his contract away from him. I love sports. Ah. Oh man, man, sports is amazing, bro. That nigga Conor McGregor was on steroids. And, and and Dana White said we gon we gonna fire the drug testing company. They fired the I'm drug testing that company I'm for calling Colin, that bro. bitch. That, hey, men's sports is amazing. Uh step up there. All right, good shit, good shit. Somebody said that. That's Frank. Ah, oh, doing that bitch like, too hard, bro. <laughs> they dead ass. They dead ass. Let go of 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 the U uh, Usada, USADA. They they.
No, when you talking about that, Otani translator got called gambler. And they just like, hey, yo, <laughs> I'll never gamble in my life. You fucking liar. No, like they, they they let that story go so quick. Made Otani make a make a public statement, and that was it. Like yo, so your translator was stealing your money and betting, huh? That's what he was doing. Mm. <laughs> Is that not wild? <laughs> your translator was stealing. Nigga said, yo, bro, that dead, bro, they dead ass, like, came out and said, yo, yeah, his translator stole his money and was gambling with it. All right, that sounds, that sounds true. Damn. What nah, nah, the translator? Yeah. We just gonna fire him. <laughs> <laughs> you just fire him, like. Oh, uh, that's on me. Nigga, that bro, that, that's such a wild thing. Oh, come on, bust that, baby. I swear to God, man. <laughs> ah, come on, yeah. Yeah, I don't got my score out, Tyro. I just got the, uh, okay. the hybrid lot down. Okay, okay. Matter of fact, speaking of that. Let me go out the point guard, Tyro. Alright. Where you at, uh... Not the pass. I was trying to swing the ball. I didn't want to make a bad pass. Yeah, that's why I said. I'm about to go full court. You at, you at square? You square? Yeah, okay, 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 okay. I'm a full court press. Man. Uh, oh, put your hand down. You keep moving my hand. What's that person? Brush your hair. Yeah, I tried to hold him up for you. You go down. Come on, dog. Nah, he he shoot. Well, wow. no, now nah, he's talking about daily, dude. Yeah, Dalen. That's all I said on that switch. Um, but not switch, but Dalen just stay on one side. I stay on the other when they. He was helping on yeah, the screen. Come get it! Come get it! 
Let me get that corner tower. You got it. You got it. Oh shit. Still away, still away. Damn, you ain't got an office rebound, you got, we got the rough. Yeah. This nigga is just hitting every fucking shot he put up. Like, just take shit. You, you got to just stay glued to him. Yeah, because he... You bait with him. I can't bait with him. I didn't think I would get the ball. Damn. Damn, oh, with me, with that pick, I'm going to try to find over. I won't be more so worried about that rebound that helped me out. Because if you don't get that rebound, then everybody's scrambling and giving up that net. Good shit. That's a good foul. Let shit hit off my head. Nah, I saw him at the top of the key. I'm like, okay, just let him take the shot from the wing. Shoot him, bitch, help me. That's wild. That's wild. Yeah, I know. Because me and Frank was gone. There we go, shit. Oh, come on, dog. Back. 
back court. Shit. Step hold, Dan. All right, good shit. Good shit. That's good. Big ass, huh? That pass was so quick after he caught it. Like, he threw it immediately. Walking ass niggas. I'm saying he there is no good shot, boy. Come on, dog. They no, nah, I'm behind them. It, it's it's nothing you could do if you behind. Them. That's that's the thing. I wish he would just step up. Why the AI down there with you? Not if they. Oh shit. That's what I'm saying. That shouldn't be open. Nah, me and Frank rotated properly. What the fuck is.
Let me go back. Let me go back to the other dude, Tom. All right. I'm that Frank. Come on, dog. Nah, I'm getting beat up on the screens. <laughs> that nigga shit must be on Hall of Fame. That's that's how it's been. It's like you can't get across, bro. I got like literally that's how it is, is, bro. I'm it's it's like that. And I'm like, yo, I just got killed. And you look I up and he way killed. over there on the other side of the court, bro. It's crazy. I, I'm like, yo, I just got, I got grabbed. Like, like, come over here. Wait, and it. I, I thought it was just me. I'm like, man, I got gold pick dodge. I'm like, ain't how am I missing this shit? This shit gotta be on Hall of Fame. That's all, that's all. Ah. Foul. Oh, Damn. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's stop this right now. Damn, I gotta hit that. Let me get that corner. I'm about to say call the timeout. Oh, now they had you wrapped up. I don't know who called the timeout, but. You got a corner for Nah. <laughs> got a foul. Sean, give me 15 seconds, brother. Good at five. <laughs> Just go up. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, no way. I don't know where I'm going.
Nah, it wasn't you, bro. Them screens at the top was. Nah, he's saying because every time he come in to replace people. Oh so nah, rude. nah, nah, bro. That that was them screens at the top was hell, bro. It's like you get. I don't know what his shit had to be on super brick wall, hall of fame, or whatever. But them, them screens was tough. Yeah, and the fact that he was shooting good too. It was eight for nine. The point guard not so much, but I think when Sean switched over to him, he started passing it up. But it was just a lot of picks. It was a it lot, was of, a lot picks of fucking at the picks. Top, though. Yeah, damn! I hate that with uh. With that and other games, I gotta, I really gotta do this. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, nah, we'll. I'll play. I'm just not playing. I'm not. Jerm, Jerm is Jerm is is just too. He's just too much like Quan, bro. It, it was bad. And I was like, I'm not gonna be the person that gonna kick people out no more. I'ma just leave. <laughs> <laughs> I'ma just take my talent somewhere else. Nah, I, bro, I didn't care. I, I truly didn't care about the winner loss. I was like, you, like, you know, like we don't play each other that often. It's not like 2K, so I'm like, all right, bro. When I do play you, I want to play, and I'm like, damn. Yeah, I was like, this is, damn, bro, I, I done played all these games, like, remember I told you, before, I was like, bro, this game is for the, for the, uh, if I win this game, we gotta change the vision, we're gonna play each other again, I'm like, alright, this is dope, I'm like, oh, he ran the ball 40 straight times in a Madden game, alright, I'm not playing no more. <laughs> that's wild, yeah, that's, that's why I don't play Madden like that, brother, that should be cheesy. So that's the thing. So that's the thing about it, Frank. So we had the first season. Davis said he's making a running back. Um, Jerm said he making a running back. I said, bet I'm gonna make a linebacker. I went against Daylon. Me and Daylon played normal. We split the Chris, season. What's going on? I went against Wait. Jerm, and Jerm was doing the thing where he would line up on the motion, and nobody would guard him in Madden because Madden is a stupid game. And now he's wide open. So I'm like, all right, bet I'm gonna make a quarterback. Let's go against each other, bro. He ran the ball every single play he was like yo sean you're not talking i was like i'm, I'm bored I, i'm just sitting over here playing court. yeah you can't do nothing if he's running and he in your the 40 straight times i was like bro you just ran the ball 40 straight times and when you don't run the ball then you throw it to, uh, throw it to yourself i'm like yo jerm you just did an end route and i know you're supposed to be doing a flat route you are literally he's like, i'm not I'm not gonna go your way, bro. You the league leader in, in interception. I mean, you're a pussy, bro. Yeah, I'm like, oh, you're a pussy, bro. I'm not. I, I, I'll get off. I'm like, bro, if you want to win this bad at Madden, bro, you got it, bro. I, I'll let you have the win. It wasn't. I had a set of presidents, though, Frank. Frank, you made a seven foot. You made a seven foot pound, four hundred tight end, and went to <laughs> the Patrick Mahomes team. He said, "How big was he, Frank?" Man, he was seven foot, four hundred pounds. <laughs> I don't know. This <laughs> nigga created Andre the Giant and put him at tight end. <laughs> and tight end with an 88 speed. Oh, shit. On Patrick Mahomes' team. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, I must be that talking was, about that nigga. That was fine. already undefeated. He created, this nigga created the fucking Andre the fucking giant, man. And put Shaq at fucking tight end, bro. What the fuck? Why y'all kick him out? He was great. How about to say? I don't know why I did it. Oh, you got kicked out? <laughs> Kicking my real quick. 
<laughs> that nigga put a center at fucking. <laughs> he got a, one of them UGA first centers of, first too. First of all, Tyrone ain't no center seven foot tall. <laughs> hey, ain't nobody ain't not playing football. This nigga, this nigga got one of them UGA fucking mm -hmm. centers, bro. Too much leg chopping for that. A seven foot. This, this is like when it was like, bro. What that shit's I heard of. LeBron James went to go play football. Or Shaq went to go play football. Like Frank made him. Frank made Shaq at tight end. Yeah. Christ, it's crazy. It's six eight players in the NFL. Yeah, not seven foot four hundred pounds. Oh no 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 no. Then he no, made him at the most. Then he made him at the most cheap position in that. Which is tight end. Tight end. He said hot. He said hot top. All flat. All, all go routes. <laughs> Post, nothing. Praise, praise the house. You supposed to know that. <laughs> all right, yeah, all right, all right. This was he a white boy, or black boy, Frank? I don't know. If you'd have made a Chinese, I'd have been like, all right, Frank. It's a stretch. I can't Frank out so quick. <laughs> you made him Chinese. I'd have been all right. I'm the the best commissioner. I kicked you out for that, and I kicked Josh out for being a father. Damn. That nigga Josh said, bro, I ain't even do nothing, so you pissed me off at 2K. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> this is a 10 to your child. Hey, who's It, 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 it was just the opposite of what we were trying to do. It was like, well, you remember when we first made it, it was like, yo, niggas ain't playing 2K. Niggas not on. Yo, we trying to run Madden real quick just to get some games going. And I was like, all right, cool. Now our player's getting better. And I'm like, Jerm, you, you caught for 3,000 yards and ran for 3,000 yards. Like, it's already annoying, bro, because like, you're doing the most. But cool, like, we'll keep it going. I'm just like, all right, now when you go against me, I want to see the nigga that try to catch for 3,000 yards. 40 straight run plays. I'm like, alright, bro, I'm out. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, bro, I'm already <laughs> dealing with you cheesing through the season. And then now that we go against each other, I'm like, that nigga, I'm like, Damon. I'm over here with, I'm over here with Dalen, bro. And me and Dalen just quiet. And Jared talking. I'm like, why are you not talking, Sean? I'm bored, bro. Like, I'm just. I'm getting blocked by a wide receiver for 40 straight plays. And then on offense, I don't even have no control, so I'm just watching this. <laughs> I resent you an invite, though, Frank. A while ago. <laughs> The fir first of all, it, was a, it wasn't even the fact, it was like, fam, you left your team that we got fantasy drafted to. It's different if it's like a, like you get to choose a team. This is a fantasy draft, so like, I don't want to be on the Baltimore Ravens with nobody on the team, but I'm here. Then I played this nigga at the end of the year. <laughs> No, you got to go back to the original team. Go to the Dolphins, man. To the team that drafted you, yes. <laughs> Josh, Josh did the same thing. Like, damn, Josh, I at least wait to the end of the year to change position. You change position after one game. And now you want to – now you out here with 480 overall cornerbacks. Hey, bro, I ain't do nothing different to the team. Yeah, bro, they drafted cornerbacks because you play safety. Now you got four, I mean, you got four eight year old cornerbacks. Yeah. <laughs> play nose tackle. Just stay on that team. And then you then you play one game three times. <laughs> then he didn't get the, the stats. The stat wasn't what he wanted. 
It matters. MP, look, it's a great day to play. Offline. You should head inside, bro. <laughs> Frank, Frank said, I didn't, I didn't get a thousand. I didn't get a thousand receiving yards that game, bro. We got nine hundred. We got to run that back. <laughs> <laughs> you should, yeah. You, coach? Practice is great, but you got to work on your shot in games too. What do you got for me? Nothing replaces live. Detroit reps. done a bad squad. Some games at the rec. Ah, you good, bro? Daily, daily. You just the problem is, bro, is that character is not a center, so we always have to get a computer center. And then you have to switch to guard the center in the paint, but you don't have high rebound. Hey, MP, I got a sound. That's what I was telling you before with that character. I'm like that character. How high is your rebound on the, on that build? It's not that it's just. It's not that it is rebound. I'm saying in other scenarios, like you're not a rebounder. You're a, you're you're power four. You're a stretch big power four, but you. You're a stretch big, power forward, but you need a you need a center next to you. I'm about to say because my the build I made is the same way. I you had a center build you. and you got two rebounds with that nigga. Yeah, <laughs> like, I was there. <laughs> yeah, you had two rebounds. I've never seen that before from a seven footer. Two, like. It should be. Maybe it ain't. Raid is not that. But I'm talking about, Bailey, you had two rebounds. Like, just two. Yeah, like. <laughs> like, you get a rebound just from, like, just a block shot of catching it. Rebounded. <laughs> that was your rebounding character. I can Nelson messed up, messed up for you. Nah, Higher offense nah, nah. rebound does matter if you're gonna sit under goal, but you play strength big. I'm about to say if you're gonna, yeah, cause I I I made a center, but I know I'm, thing, I'm gonna be shooting. Offense rebound, like if you're gonna be an inside big with a high offense rebound, that makes sense. If you're gonna be a stretch big. If you're gonna with be a shooting. Offense rebound, it's like the defense. offense rebound don't matter because you're at the three point line. You're gonna be at the three point line, yeah. That's it's, just kind of kind of twenty two with that. Kind of con like con I ain't gonna say common sense, but it's like what you want to do with your build though. If you're gonna sh you're gonna shoot then. You don't need offensive rebound. You need it, but you don't need it as much as you need. Well, yeah, after we had played a game where you had two rebounds, bro, I think a lot of people were, you know, out of it. <laughs> Let's go. I'm ready. Let's see. Even if you don't know how to play with the character, though. You had two rebounds. Like two. That's one and a half. <laughs> <laughs> like, you are a rebounder. Like. Come around, come around. No, you finished. It was a 2-2-2 two, two, two game. And then you finished with something else. And at first I had to bat. Like, hey, guys, technically they're not missing shots. We got to do something. <laughs> I'm like, And then Topper had a 15, 25, 25 right before that, so that didn't make it any better. Ah, uh, <laughs> on the Dolphins. Hey, that's a good team. That's a good. 
That's a good team to be on, man. We need a tight end in Miami, to be honest with you. It's fantasy dress. So it's, it's everybody. Uh, oh, it just got up. Uh, just okay. So between Frank doing that and then Josh don't share play because he trash. I'm like, yeah, y'all. League supposed to be fun, bro. Madden supposed to be a fun game. It ain't supposed to be 2K. 2K, no. no not, absolutely not. not no more. 2K is not fun, bro. I play this because I I don't like playing Madden because Madden is. I play. We played what, what uh, that three v three in the Gatorade the other day, Frank, and then Quan replaced Dalen. And I think everybody just stopped. Oh yeah, Quan. <laughs> Man, Madden is. I don't know. I don't like where a person could just beat you playing one play the whole. Like that ain't football, man. But Frank, did you notice that? Did you notice that in three v three when they left? Her? Corn flicks them and everybody just got quiet. <laughs> <laughs> when you left in in uh three v threes, Corn uh switch uh switch spots for you, and everybody just got quiet, bro. <laughs> it's just so different. Yeah, Corn something else, man. That nigga Frank, Frank starts skipping game when they go smoke a couple times. <laughs> Next thing you know, Germ, they're calling everybody trash. I was like, oh shit. Well, there it goes. Corn not get corn flopping, not getting back on deep. Like <laughs> it's not good. You know what they say. Board man. Jeremy kill me because I'm Jeremy and bad. I'm like, Jeremy, I'm not the big call. You want me to call it? Sean, you terrible. I'm like, bro, it's not me calling you. You don't have to go at me. Yeah. <laughs> if a nigga start acting different because Corn started talking, yeah, I'm clowning. I'm sorry, bro. If a nigga, if a nigga get on the game and tell you I should have 30 shots and you let him get 30 shots, I'm clowning you. You pay for this game. <laughs> <laughs> but that's cool. I'm just saying. It depends on the scenario. Listen to him. Then I'm, I'm a clown you. Oh man, oh bro, not night. Hello. Nah, yeah. Okay. Can you open the door for me? Give me a second. Okay. Uh. <laughs> the first game that we came back, the first game that I played with Jason, he joined the party. That nigga said, my bad, Sean, hold on. Hold on. Gary now. Gary me now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nah, we haven't. We're waiting on you. Feed him what? Tuesday night. Huh? He's been chilling. But uh, he, he, uh, me and Jason had got on the game. He said, bro, you need to talk to Frank. I said, for what? 
he don't want to pass the ball in the 5v5. Your mom didn't answer what I called. Yeah. Yeah, he, he, yeah, he usually, you need to talk to him. Uh, you and me talk, you and me talk to my best friend about 2K? Yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> fam, it, first of all, fam, it was it was it was days later. I was like, fam, it it was no, it was it was it was, it was days later, bro. I'm like, wait, you want me to you want me to talk to Frank about two K? Like in person, like like a, a real, not a virtual friend. A, you mean taught him about? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Communi communication is key. Yeah, I'm like. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I can I can see Frank. Frank Frank just be having fun, man. When Frank get out there, you could just tell he be freestyling. He need, he need like Kyrie out there. That's how I'm like. I'm sitting. I'm like, bro. I even told Jason. I said, bro. When Jason got the PS5, he's like, I can't he can, I can't get on yet. And we joined that party. And nigga said, you got to talk to Frank. I said, Jason, how much VC you need? I got you right now, bro. <laughs> just tell, give me a number. How much you need to be comfortable to play with right now, bro? I gotta get out of this chat. Damn. <laughs> Even yesterday, I didn't want to play, but I'm like, damn, three of my homies, they need a fourth or a fifth. I look at the party, I'm like, it's eight niggas in the party. Why are they? Is there eight niggas in the party just talking while Frank Bowles and Daylight <laughs> run 2K? <laughs> oh, man, come on. I said the same thing, yeah, bro. Yeah, that's true. That's true, though. <laughs> Medina's tough to play with, bro. He's tough to play with. Bro, we played it. We played a rec game one day with Medina, and the center scored thirty-five. And he was an AI. <laughs> I ain't never seen AI score thirty-five, bro. That shit, wow, bro. <laughs> I'm like, all you. All you gotta do is stay in front of him. Oh, I say the AI is so weird because I'm like, if you literally just stand next to him, he'll just pass it. Yeah, he ain't finna do nothing. I'm about to say, sometimes if you the center, though, you, 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 you'll lose him. <laughs> At some point, bro, the moment, the moment, the, the moment he even got twenty, I'm like, yo, y'all on y'all. <laughs> yes. Giving up 30 to a computer center is wild because all you gotta do is stand next to him. In the room. I will. Because, like, you ain't even. Honestly, you go against the computer center, bro. You you can actually just stand next to him in the corner and put your controller down. Yeah, you don't have to do nothing to him. Because <laughs> as soon as he catches it, his team is gonna call back for it. I see.
nigga said I chose not to guard. I'm like, I know. I don't think he was hitting step backs. <laughs> like, <laughs> I, I don't think he was like she was like Kyrie. I'm pretty sure he was wild up in quarter three. Quarter three. <laughs> Dying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I know exactly what quarter three. Right there. In the room. Man, no, nah, they gonna leave his ass open. Hey, what you working on? And they gonna cuss you out of the chat. Whose man is that? <laughs> like, pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up, shit. Better let you die than ever. Yeah. Whose man is that? Yeah, yeah, they don't care about that shit. <laughs> I realized that it was, it was one day when we were playing, yeah. and I'm like, oh, y'all don't care about winning. Y'all nah. just trying to get clowned out there, so y'all can clown niggas. All right, get out. <laughs> yeah, although y'all just trying to clown each other. <laughs> you gave up 20. <laughs> it's all about scenarios. High <laughs> risk. What you apologize for then? <laughs> <laughs> I'm apologizing to y'all for doing something I was gonna do no matter what. Let y'all. Nigga said, I'm, nigga said, nigga J. Cole. He just didn't sit right in my spirit. Just one of them nice. We go. I do a street ball tournament. I don't feel like going to the wreck, man. I don't have enough of that shit. I need to switch builds and this shit here done got laggy though. Shit start freezing up, man. I'll do some street ball. How much money I got? Though? I got a little, a little money. Oh shit! I hustled up 14 bands. All right, we'll do some street ball. We'll keep grinding our build, man. Man, I had this build up the. I had this build up the gold. And. Whew. Look at this shit, it be laggy. I don't know what it is about the uh, 2K. When you got multiple bills, though, and you switch to another bill, it gets really, it get real laggy. Like, this shit here just be... I want to switch to my other bill, but I know it's going to, like, freeze up, so I just play with this one. Keep grinding them. This how you grind your badges though. If you if you working on a um I ain't playing with y'all, I'm done for the night, nay. We get another center. Oh man, they be wanna it done, I thought it Nah 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 nah. I don't know, like when you got multiple bills, it'll um like that first it just gets real laggy. That's what they need to fix. I don't know if it's a server thing. They might be a server thing though. They might be switching from server back to the from one server to the next. So I think it's a server thing. It'll get real laggy though. 
I need to get on my other build, but we going I'm gonna I'm rock out with this one. We we'll just keep working with it. We come in here, we just be grinding badges. Whatever that we need to work on, we just we work on it. It don't matter if you win the game or not, but you want to win it. Barking. I get two threes. I only got two builds in the do that they do need to fix that. Yeah, and you would think that you would think that that shit would be fixed by now. That's that's the thing. Like I've been having that issue since the first since I made my second build. Like you switch. And then you go to the next and everything just get real laggy. So it's like you have to close out the app. And when you stream it, if you close out the app, it's going to end the stream. So I just, I would rather stay with this bill because... But this is how you grind your badges, though. And like at the top, right there, we'll say like Dead Eye, Agent 3. Those are the badges. Whatever badge you want to pop up is, you know, whatever badge you grinding. So, they going to double team you when, uh, anytime you get eight points, the computer going to come and help. Like with that, the back down Punisher, and then Green Machine, and then Post Fade Phenom, those are badges. Uh, what other badge I need to work on? But I think this this build here good. I just need to play with it more in the wreck. It's that sound I need to work on. Let's go. We all know defense. Oh, come on, man. Oh shit. I'm gonna knock my drink off. I need to work on more post moves with this build though. See how they come out for the double team? Shit out of it's a lot of button play though. You gotta know your buttons. Man, I'm a, yeah, I'm gonna knock my goddamn drink over, boy, trying to grab it. How's he able to contest that? That's that's crazy. He's gonna pull it. Yeah, yeah, he missed it though. I hit mine though. This how you learn your shots. Cause in the wreck, that um, that window's not gonna be as big. 
like let me see if I can show y'all like that window gets smaller here yeah So like when it comes to shooting on here, it's more of a momentum thing. It used to be, it used to be like whatever your um, shot is. So if you had a good shooter, you, you just had a good shooter. On here, the game more built on momentum. So um, how can I explain it? Like if you hit one shot, it's going to make it easier to shoot the second shot. I, that shot shouldn't have went in. I didn't. I didn't get an excellent release on that one, but. <laughs> we'll see. I'll go into the next game. Let's see how your badge go up. Like the scoop. You do one scoop layup, it's gone. You do a floater, it's gonna make your, your float back go up. It's it's a lot to the game. If you try and learn it. We're not going to another game though. I got my street ball challenge out of the way. We made a little little bit of money off of that too. Alright, so we'll go back in. We'll do some 2K fundamentals. So you when I play, I like to play the, the lowest level. Cause that mean I can practice on this mother. So I'm gonna go with the 82. I'm a eight, I'm a 92 here, 82. So that just make more sense. And we just gonna match them up against. I put him against him. And then the best player, I put my best defender on him. Cause you get to pick and choose who you want to. Who you want to guard? Who? So I'm guarding the sorry person. My best defender's guarding the best of, so I ain't got to worry about him scoring, basically. So I kind of can just do what I want to do. We skip all of this. So I probably didn't put my badges before I came in here to see what I need to work on. But we just going to work on everything. So, see how short he is over me? So, I can pretty much do whatever I want to do to him. So, if I was working on blocks, I, blocks would be easy. And that's it. And see, oh, it's popped up. Catch and shoot popped up. Those are badges. They already gold. Once they get gold, set a screen, pass it. You can make them. How do you feel about Carlin Clark going one WNBA draft? I don't like it. She should have went to the NBA. <laughs> she got somebody got to replace Steph Curry. Nah, I think it's good though. I think it's good for the league. I think they need. She's gonna be like the. <laughs> she gonna be like the um, Larry Bird of the WNBA. <laughs> nah, for real. I like it though. I like her. I'm. I want to go see a game when she comes to Atlanta. Oh, she played Atlanta Dream. I need to find uh, some tickets because I know they probably like five dollars. But I want to see her play though in person. So she gonna get a different crowd of people, and she gonna sell tickets. Come on, bro. Her and the girl Angel a Angel is it Angel Reese Angela Reese Angel. She gonna sell tickets too. They gonna sell tickets. That's for sure. They gonna raise the prices. They gonna raise the prices, yeah. 
Cause right now the NBA, WNBA is damn that free to go watch a game. Angel Reese. So I would pay to I would pay to see her in person. I would pay to see uh Caitlin Clark. They just not gonna get the money. That's the only thing they ain't gonna get the money. They WNBA like they were saying on the stream, like on they were saying in the group, the chat, like they getting seventy five thousand dollars a year to play professional basketball. Like that's mm, yeah. They getting seventy five thousand to play to play professional basketball. Like that's crazy. I, but then yeah, yeah, yeah. They made more. They made more playing college basketball off of just NIL deals. So, but I think they finna they finna raise the price right now though. They finna raise the price of the tickets. The tickets finna go up. They probably the tickets right now like ten, fifteen dollars. No, the the money there. The money there. Most, a lot of even with NBA players, they um, I've heard NBA players that that don't even spend they um, uh, they 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 cut their salary. They spend endorsement money. So with them being high profile prospects, I think it was good for them to leave. They just got to get other other deals. So when they get a Nike kind of, when they get you know fashion over deals and you stay that extra year. I mean, that makes sense, though. Because you ain't going to get shit from, from the league itself. But maybe it's because of the momentum behind them right now. Yeah. Because they don't really have... And I think that's the best thing they did was to get them in out dude. So I get it. Because they was tripping by the girl Angel Reese. She was doing models and doing modeling and shit for uh, Sports Illustrated and like shit. That's money. That's side money. They, that's what the NIL, NIL deals for. Making make that money on the side because you ain't gonna make that shit in the league. So you let them make that money. So it's gonna be the same in the NBA. I mean WNBA. It's just that they gonna have a, a guaranteed contract or money that they just gotta let sit. Like if I'm making seventy five thousand dollars a year in the WNBA, I don't even gotta touch that because I'm getting a million dollars from Nike. I'm getting a million dollars from Fashion Nova for wearing they underwear, and then I get a couple million dollars for coming over here talking on this interview, and you do all of that. You don't even need your salary. But when it's time to negotiate, it's time to negotiate that money and it's time for them to, you know, pay out. And you like, look, I'm making millions of dollars over here, millions of dollars over here, and y'all finna offer me another seventy five thousand. I I'm good. I retire or some shit like that. <laughs> so that shit get kind it get kinda weird though. Cause the NBA negotiations, that should be just guaranteed money up front. So you kind of got to market yourself. So I like what Angel, Angel Reese is doing. Her taking them the model pictures and shit, and they was hating on her like, oh, you know. She taking pictures and, and she this and she that. That girl make it. She, she. Oh, yeah. Because if not, somebody going to steal that little money. But... I ain't gonna lie, I'm out of it having to see uh, Caitlin Clark, the first woman in the NBA. To be honest with you, that shit would have been dope. She got drafted by the Golden State Warriors and shit like that. That would have been dope, but because I saw Ice Cube offer to like three, three to five million to come play for the big, the big three. 
That shit would I would have took that. If I'm her, I would've taken that. I'm like shit, give me that. I need that little bit too. They come play for the big three. So it's crazy that one ice cube being ice cube. <laughs> shit, if I ice if I'm looking at her I'm like damn if Ice Cube can offer me three million dollars, five million dollars to come play for a three versus three. Probably because it's men. She would have been the only lady playing against men. So that's you gotta think, um the size of a woman's ball and the size of a man's ball, they would have it wouldn't have been it would have been about gender. It's just the way the game played. It wouldn't have been about the fact that she's a woman playing with men. I think she would have been okay with that, but it's women have a lighter ball. So they would have had a big discrepancy about that because if she's shooting she's used to shooting with a lighter ball and then men play with a heavier ball, then it would have been like, Well, what kind of ball are we gonna play with? That would have probably been the biggest issue because that did, Yeah, so I didn't even think of that. So yeah, that shit with the dude shooting like nigga, I can't shoot with this heavy ass ball. And the dude would have been like, shit, the ball too light for us, so but three million dollars, I'd have been like, shit, I shoot with a fucking tennis ball. So I thought that I thought that would but I, that made sense though if she turned it down, but then from my interview, she didn't even know nothing about it. She was like, I didn't even know I got a I, she said she I, I heard it on the internet just like everybody else, so maybe that wasn't real. But I'm all for it. I like to change, especially in sports, because right now we ain't. <laughs> Mother, give me $5 million, but I'll be throwing that fucking tennis ball across the court. But right now, we ain't got nothing. Once LeBron leaves, that's it. After LeBron leaves the NBA. It's basketball. I don't even know what basketball is going to be right now. It ain't no more Kobe's, definitely no more Jordan's, no more Shaq's, no more Allen Iverson's. LeBron leave. We got Wimby Yama, a French guy that speak decent English. But we ain't got no more Kobe's. So it's, it's I don't know what we gonna have. We ain't got but... <laughs> a couple more years with LeBron. That's it. I might not watch basketball for a minute. Yeah, that's it. I don't know. I'd rather shit put Caitlyn Jenner on the 76. That'd have been I. Yeah. I'd have paid to watch her, but at this point, it ain't, it ain't nothing going on in the NBA right now. NBA just. We got niggas out there with perms. Talking about they emo. Not my cup of tea. Face, face with tears of Man. <laughs> he said, oh, I missed it. Man, Jimmy Butler of the Miami Heat. Good block. He decided to have a perm for his pictures. And that has been turned off. <laughs> I thought Dwayne Wade was bad for shit. I thought D-Wade was bad, but then Jimmy Butler taking pictures with a perm in his head. I was like, all right. Tap. Man, I don't know. I missed that. But yeah. I don't know, man. Basketball ain't what it used to be. Me bad. Yeah, D-Wade went out bad, man. Oh, 
the shot. D Wade went out bad. That's some that money, but that money, <laughs> that money. How you doing? All kind of shit, man. I don't know. I don't know if I want that much money. I want some money, but not like that. I don't know if it's if it's gonna change my ways, you know. Oh shit, he closed. I don't know. How much is too much money? Then this guy, I ain't got nothing else to do. Yes, I ain't got nothing, nothing else to do type of money. We just going. <laughs> we going to change our lifestyle. We ain't got so much money. We <laughs> just going to change how we live. Like, I don't know. That might be too much money for me, man. He got that P. Diddy money. I don't know if I want party every night money. I want some, I want some money where I gotta work at least once a week. It made me feel responsible. But you get that party every night money the way you just ain't got no responsibility. <laughs> you can just be whatever the fuck you want. You just got that reading rainbow money. Yeah, I don't know. That shit kind of weird. Teachers on though. Who am I to judge? Let's count my little pennies. Man, I want to switch bills. I shouldn't be working on this bill. Hey. Got that one off though. Ball game. Oh, oh, oh. That boy started cutting up. Nah, all right, nah. Try to hold him down, man. I don't want to show out. He show out too bad. Badges go up. Hey, all right. Where we at? Are we out of, uh, yeah, we out of boots. <laughs> Badges. Right. So, ankle braces. It's crazy, this bitch gets 64 badges. Comeback kid, float game. So they want you to they want you to work on all these badges at one time. That should be crazy. Off ball pass, scooper. So you do like scoop layups and then make your layup badge go up. I don't really do spin cycles. I don't do shit like that. Special delivery. Those are alley hoops. You throw it out of space creators. Those like that crazy ass dribbling shit niggas be doing. Triple sprite. Whistle badge. That make you that make you get fouled a lot. Whistle. The whistle badge. Acrobat. Aerial wizard. That's to catch alley oops. So like you look at your badge levels. Like you'll start out on bronze, you go to silver, then you go to gold. So you have to work your badges from bronze to silver to gold. So you have to keep working on that same badge. I don't do bunny hops and shit like that. I don't do that. Challenger. So this, I got that locked. Guard up, I got that locked. I don't have to work on that. Dream shape. And move forward. Some badges don't go past bronze. So it's how you, however you make the build, if you want movable force to go up, you have to make it, make your build to have that that badge on the. So it's kind of like 
Customizing a car or some shit like that. Open looks. This determines how often I hit open shots. So I got that up to goal. It's maxed out. But if I don't hit open shots, it'll go down. Reading pass. Pro touch. That's when I do my layups with my analog stick. Workhorse. Big truck driver. I be driving through line. I push a bitch out of the way. That's what that big truck driver for. AG3. Claymore. Uh, green Machine. Post Fade. You know, when I was doing the post phase, that's what I was trying to get. Make sure my post phase stay up. Physical handle. Actor. Yeah, so the only badge I ain't got is Interceptor. Slithery. So when you come to this... this this gym, this uh, street ball shit, you gotta work on your badges. Corner specialist. And then when you go to the rec, when you play your NBA games, it, it all do the same thing. Matter of fact, let me go play an NBA game. We'll, we'll do it, yeah. Where's 1044? I'm trying to get this streaming time up though, so we really trying to stream hard. So we'll do an NBA game. So let's go do an NBA game real quick. It's a big game, so we gotta. Niggas got to face Kawhi Leonard. So let me go holler at my coach. Coach, what up? How I get a girl, Coach? I got some film I want you to. What you want? What you want to talk about? Now, that's a good pass, right? Uh huh. Well, the fact that you pause the video and I can see Kawhi's about to pounce, I'm gonna say no. <laughs> good point. But you see what I'm saying, though. I gotta be extra careful around Kawhi. He'll surprise you. Don't get go shoot. with your passes. Go shoot all over him, man. We got us some new shorts and shit. See our Kobe jersey on, man. We ain't still no Kawhi. All right, I'll perform Kawhi Leonard and teammate Gray and be yeah. And then we gotta win. We just gotta win the game tonight. So, all right. So we finna talk our street clothes on. We gonna be all black. We got the Jordan fives. We can't change clothes, but we got the Jordan fives. Let me see if I can change shoes. Let me see. I do. We want to go some phone pauses tonight. Shit, I might go Air Force One. I might go Air Force One on his ass. You know, it just depends on how I'm feeling. Jordan ones. The Jordan 3. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm a big Jordan 5 guy. Well, I might be feeling Ray Allen-ish, though. And go Jordan 13 on him. Nah, them ugly. Okay. Well, I, I might zip them bitches up on them guys. Them, that shit ugly here. Yeah. I think that was an ugly Jordan right there, too. You want to go Scotty Pippen on him? Yeah, we go Chuck Taylor on him. LeBron. Yeah, I don't really see no shit. I like that LeBron, though. I love the LeBron, uh, what's that, the 13, 11? I think that's an 11. I love the LeBron. So we gonna rock out with them tonight. We got different color, G. We got different color, all black. Got the South Beach. We gonna go Christmas on a nigga. I'm gonna get this nigga a present. We gonna go to Christmas, LeBron. All right, let's get some boost. That's a night. We gonna run this game and wrap this shit up. We gonna set the time. Uh, we gonna go eight minutes. 
We gotta make sure we win the game. If we go eight minutes, we definitely gonna win the game. All right, Kwai, I got something for your ass, nigga. Anybody ever been to Orlando Magic game? Got warm up. Get us some shots in. I missed that. Give it a ball, boy. I missed the fuck out of that. I missed that too. I really gotta learn this jump shot. There we go. I've been shooting pretty good with it lately, though. PG 13? I don't want to see that shit. Man. There you go. Oh, y'all ain't just finna be. Make it look like I ain't playing deep. Look at me. Just looking at that. Man, don't do me like that. Y'all see me? That right. Y'all can't let Paul Joy get off on me like that, man. He ain't like that. He ain't like that. That right. That right. Dirty ass breeds. Happy Halloween and welcome to NBA basketball Let on go. 2K Sports. Nothing scary go, about man. this matchup. And on tap tonight, it's oh, the they got me on PG-13. Going up against the Orlando Magic. Damn, I ain't gonna do shit tonight. Fred Berry and Grant Hill. This Watch is out. Brian Anderson, along with reporter Ali LaForce. Well, granted, our Halloween matchup here. What's up, boy? You think the favorite team could be? Let me get off on y'all, man. A scare get here on the superstar. This is a night where it feels like just about anything can happen. So, BA, I Let's expect the tricks from both sides, and we'll see who's. Oh shit! Turn that bitch over. We'll be watching the battle between MP and Kawhi That's all. Leonard. He ain't like that. Tonight. This is the first ever meeting between the two, and no opponent is really trying to on, seek boy. out a showdown Show with Kawhi. He's too physical and too efficient. Get on, he affects every part of the game. Oh shit! You know, I'm very curious to see how MP comes out and sets the tone in this one. You know he wants to make a statement switch on in this game. And the starting there we go. Hello. Ben Carroll plays the four with Carter Jr. at center. Suggs runs point with Harris next to him. And it's the prodigy. Oh, the come three. on, dog. And it's the Clippers ball. Oh, I forgot I got this shit on hard. <laughs> he missed game. it. All right, yeah, we got we got to play for real. Play I got this shit on hard. The court in that game. They were able to seize come control screen, and my maintain boy. it. And going back and watching oh, come that back. game, there was not one spot on the floor that they did not own. Oh, they get a oh shit! All right, I'm good with you. I forgot to put this shit. I ain't take it off of easy. Oh <laughs> shit! He missed it. Outside for Harden from behind the arc. He gonna hit it though. Damn. For one to start the game. Oh no, we might lose this bitch. Here's the prodigy. No, we ain't. Nigga, get my three back. Fuck about my face. Teams running long range plays that are working. Well, both of them looking towards the three point line. And I like to see that. Especially oh, they got me a power for it. Are made buckets. Now here's Harden. Don't let Harden get out, man. We saw him score 22. Hey, y'all. Let's go. We run. Defense as tough as it comes right there. He's a hard man. Miss Green, my boy. Gets the ball to the rim. Looks like this could Where be a at? bounce back here for the Clippers, Brett. After on, they man. were knocked out early last oh, season. Shit. Yeah, you just shake your head and you think about this team not being healthy and how far they could go. But that's part of it, right? No PG or Kawhi late in the series. They're looking for oh, some fuck. redemption this year, and you feel like it's their last shot. 
The Magic have gone one of four to begin this one. That boy got sick. Here's the prodigy. There we go. Gets it to go. Makes him two for five. Yeah, here's a list of things I don't want to do, and right at the top is guard that guy. Yeah, no, nah, you don't want to guard me, man. Plumley a screen. Pass to Leonard. Oh, shit. Ooh, and Leonard throws it down. He had me beat. Man, we love so he touched the ball. Takes it over into his own hands. What a special play. Man, give me the ball, man. We need a tap on this shit. Three minutes in. Here's the prodigy. Man, I'm that nigga, man. Get out of my face. It's Orlando with a three. Right. Y'all see the moss skin in. Especially when you give him that kind of room. Switch, 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 switch. I got him. Harden with it. They kind of how you learn how to like really play the the five v five shit though. Like that three v three shit cool, but oh shit. Can't be him up. But then how you kind of learn how to like really play like in the red. Carter a screen on Leonard. Pass to Ben Carroll. Hell no. Here's the prodigy. Oh, we got the white ball on us. Give me that pick, man. Six on the shot clock. Jacks up a three, and again, Hit them bitches, it's though. the magic from deep. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Uh -oh. They should continue to ride the hot hand. Shoot these bitches lights up. George against Ben Carroll. You get hot spots, too, from playing this shit. Humbly it just, screen. the game be so much longer. Here's Harden. Oh, George shit. No, lead the man yes. open. And a nice assist from Harden. George with the innate ability and sense, and he has to get it off quick. 4-3, and his fifth basket. Now 5 hey. looking comfortable out there. Well, he doesn't look satisfied with the lead right now. He wants more, and he looks like he's going to get it. Oh, he beat my ass like this. Throws it down. Leaping ability is off the charts. Not the biggest power forward, but outstanding. It's rising up off the ground. And so here is Orlando. Get the analog. Their last shot to go. The fact that he contested it. He didn't even put his hand up. I got him. I got him down. What you doing? The rebound by the prodigy. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that opening. And there are the magic with got my fade, boy. It's been Live a it dominant in. night for him. Oh, is Westbrook coming in. Throughout. And it's Leonard with the ball for the Clippers. Trailing by four. Pass to Plumley. I thought I got this shit on hard because um, cause this is how I shoot in the wreck. So having it on hard, it lets you, uh, lets a floater ain't no go. way. Orlando grabs the miss. You get used to the a shooting on the wreck. Coming against the Lakers in their last game play. Just a tough road loss. You're going against players fate, man. who are comfortable shooting in their own building. You have to find a way to disrupt their focus. Yeah, they couldn't do it in that one. Always a step slow and closing out the shooters and maybe hey, we up. Of we up, on the floor. Just not enough energy, and that's a tough way to win on the road. Time called here. The Clippers decide to talk it over. Look at Tyron. As the coaches Luke. draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's that key to game. keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink. Especially towards the end of games when the physical toll... Of Come on, the bro. You got to play defense, man. And I think rock the baby on your ass and everything. Points. Orlando leading. Get this nigga off the screen on Westbrook. Oh, shit, Pass my bad. Carroll. Here's the prodigy. Let's the three fly. Damn. It's rebounded by Zubats. He didn't make oh, them pay that for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Kicks it out to Westbrook. Ah, oh, fuck. He can't shoot. Coffee, the pass to Westbrook. Inside. Here's Leonard. Good work there. Man, come on, no. Leonard's got nine. I switch back on him. Y'all can go ahead. defense is getting manhandled down low. You have to wonder well, if you're at 100% right now. All right, Grant, talking about the beats of Zubats. What is that? My favorite, man. I'm shooting a bitch for half court. He's willing to challenge shots at the rim, refusing to give anything easy. Now here's Westbrook. He can't shoot. A 14 Damn. point game for him in the win against San Antonio. Uh, let's not yeah. forget about the assist. His playmaking was critical for this team. Here's the prodigy. Yeah, my favorite, man. And again, it's the magic from deep. 
and the defense is really allowing them I'm to try to shoot this bit binoculars off Westbrook taking his point. time here pass to Leonard don't let that bitch shoot You can't dribble on let that big get man come on dog the rebound by the there we go the prodigy's got four rebounds in the game it gotta be the shoes y'all it gotta be the shoe tears of joy face with tears of joy face with tears of joy it is shoe launches it got my favorite it's the magic from got my fave just incredible i mean he's really making it it is shoe i put the crib shoes on I put the crimson shoes on for Halloween during Halloween. So that made me uh, that made me unstoppable. That's all. He ain't shooting like that. Bro, you gotta get the rebound. Man. We trying to blow these bitches out. Bro, I'm trying to get these big money. Here's the prodigy. We saw him go. I'm shooting that big head off, man. He was unstoppable, and he was dominant in their last outing, and the same thing here tonight. We might drop a hundred on right the bit tonight. Seems to be nobody standing in his way, no roadblocks. Wait, can we even make a hundred? <laughs> the half time, my first quarter. The half time. So it's the Orlando Magic. They have a nice knock. Wait, is that? Hold on, I didn't get to see. That's the end of the first quarter. So we do 30, 30, 30. That's 90. This game has so, not okay. exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. All right, guys, what do you think about the magic here? Oh, they are looking in this guy so far, especially on offense. Well, if they wanted to so we up by well, nine, we're going to blow them out. Though. Momentum right away, and they just didn't let it go in that quarter. On the court for Orlando, Mo Wagner is out there with Jonathan Isaac. Then there's Wagner, then there's Anthony. PG. And it's the prodigy in at the small forward position. Magic shooting an unreal 69%. Really special stuff here. I'm shooting a 60, unreal 69 <laughs> To the paint. Here's Wagner. Pass to the prodigy. Three pointer. He oh my Hey, bro, shoot 90%. The prodigy's got 33. 12 straight points off threes. This defense is oh, not shit. extending very well. No way. I know he ain't no never done. Man, you get so caught up in the bravado of someone scoring on you and you wanting to even the score. Unfortunately, he couldn't answer back. He gets it in there. The prodigy's got 30. Hey, get them badges He's up, He's carried bro. much of the scoring load tonight. You can easily dog, but reach, don't you got to work on your badges. For three, George. Drops good shot. That's a good shot. Man, he's been doing that for a long time. You just can't give George that kind of look. Here's the prodigy. George defending the prodigy. And the bucket That's is That's how good. you get a scoop late. The prodigy's ah. got seven points here in the quarter. It's just executing at a high level. I gotta get the float as well, too. The defense allows and putting in the work. Basketball IQ is That's something all. that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. And he's having an ugly quarter from the field. Where you let him pack? Man, come on. You don't block that shit? What kind of man are you? Now Westbrook. Five points in the game. Kicks it to George. Hey, puts up a three. Oh, he might and hit that. that one yeah, comes off the assist by Westbrook. George has got his third bucket of the night. Yeah, he couldn't on, connect bro. on Get anything the from superstar. outside in the first quarter, but now he's at two threes bro, what are you in the doing second on the screen? quarter, and he looks much better. The prodigy passes to Wagner. You got to hit that. Right. He's now one for three. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. All right, buddy, you can just shit block him. <sighs> oh, shit. Pass to George. Oh, shit. Westbrook outside, and here's George. Here's That's what's up. Off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. The Magic have gone four for six here on the second. Grant, it's fair to say this Magic team is still coming into its own as far as the youth on the roster. Yeah, not a lot of NBA service time up and down the wow. roster, but tons and tons of talent. I mean, they've done very well constructing the roster. Now to develop it, and they'll see the way. You play the game, you got to do different shit. I could keep shooting, but Zubox with a screen on Anthony. it's not going to help me. 
deflected. That's sure, yeah. And I love how it it's not gonna help me uh, shooting so every time. Developing badges. In his first so you gotta work on different badges. Shots. Set yourself up for different. Here's the prodigy. George defending. The prodigy passes to Anthony. And again, it's Orlando with a three. I well, see you, bye. Part of the game plan was to neutralize the crowd. And guess what? Mission accomplished. Always a good sign he of missed. maturity and steps forward when you can take this kind of effort, focus, and concentration on Come the on road there. to get a win. Wagner with a screen on George. And the whistle blows. That's a foul, man. You can't PJ be doing all Tucker. that. That's his first foul of the game. Plumley's checked in for the Clippers. Harden comes in for Tucker. Wendell Carter, he's checked in for Orlando. Suggs comes That's in for Anthony. Man. And the prodigy gets it to go. Getting buckets at a critical time. Just give him the ball and let him go to work. You heard it. Give me the ball. Let it. me go. Wagner picks him up. Plumley a screen on Wagner. Harden from outside That's off. gets it to drop. Now two of four. He's never shy to let it go from three-point range. Harden wants to make the D's job as tough as possible. Here's the prodigy. And he's got 41 now. Chalk up to that. <laughs> the prodigy's got 43 oh, I made points. It. I mean, the stroke looks good. He's moving well out there. What a sensational start I don't know to what this that game was from the field. Now here's Westbrook. The D's right on him. Over Suggs. Westbrook can't hit it. And you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight. Here's the Prodigy. Count it. Nice little floater. The Prodigy's got 45 points. Just tremendous. <laughs> nigga sitting on the big man. He uses it to his line. advantage to get the easy bucket. Plumley a screen on Wagner. Pass to man. Shit out of here. Now Westbrook. Takes he the can't three. shoot. Rebounded by Suggs. Here's the prodigy. He has 45 points. Set Miss Strangey. Picked by Isaac. The prodigy passes to Isaac. Oh, and he took ah. a hard foul on the shot. So he's going to line. shoot a pair. And with load management, some say it's the team's job at times Yikes. to protect players from themselves. How different is that from when you play, Grant? You know, B.A., it's very different. I think teams now are much smarter Go assessing get some load and risk and looking more at the long-term big picture of their players. That free throw good from Isaac. Can Unlike we drop a hundred? Can we drop a hundred tonight? Let's see. If we can. First overall pick. I don't think I ever hit a hundred in the game. I do think they nailed it, taking Paolo Bancaro, so I might need to. a six-ten playmaker. Bancaro was rookie of the year, and he's certainly a player you can build around. Leonard's if I can get fifty. Norm Powell comes in for man, and again, I don't think I got a hundred. Oh, can't punish the defense for leaving him open that time. That's a frustrating miss for a really steady jump shot. Hey, you flow that bitch near well time. And extremely focused. The coaching staff probably most proud of the effort of this team on both ends of the floor here tonight. Will it go? No, it won't go. Magic. Carter's got oh, a short rebound in this one. He hurt. He what the fuck you doing? I hurt. Then get your ass out of the way. Got a hole in hand and shit. The steal. <laughs> Orlando calls timeout. What we call timeout? Because the man hurt. Bro, we ain't got time for that, bro. Harris Figure it out. In for Carter. And here's a look yeah, at man, the we ain't got time for that. last season. No wasted chances among this group. Second, Mason Plumley. So consistent from the floor. He shot it at a great clip last season. Come on, let's drop it. Let's try to get 100. I, I don't know if I ever hit 100. Here in the second. Here's the prodigy. Oh, oh they Leonard double defending. teaming me. Pass to the prodigy. Ah. Gets the 14 footer to fall. The prodigy's got 49. And Wait, hold up. We got one more. Okay. And he did that so well in college. Subs That's all. did well in the league, too. And their Go. physical dominance has been on display. He a 10 rebound advantage is he a good indicator of how this game is gone. This guy is as hot as they come from. We distance. have 52 at halftime. You almost have to pick him up once he This ain't the hardest level, but it's the level before that, though. <laughs> Westbrook outside. 
Pass to Leonard. Ah, the shit. Three. I let him shoot. And it's Orlando with a rebound. He can't shoot. The other team just looks more insane. What you going to do? Right Get out of my way. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end. And can't find a way to get the Let's go when I won't, man. And no. the prodigy gets it to go. His production from range has been nothing short of astounding. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get him. We're going to drop 100 tonight, yeah, man. Their offense has been grinding to a halt. Give me that. In transition, the magic on the run. It's oh, he ate it on my alley. Oh, Shot dog. Separated by five. Come on, dog. Give me that. Hit him up. There we go. Here's Suggs. Hello. Bounded by Westbrook. Suggs with the bucket. Suggs has got his first points of the night. They've been the more poised team. Hang on, I like playing this shit here better than Rick. Yeah, just really pouring it on right now, trying to take away the opposition's motivation to keep competing in this one. Damn. And I missed one. So it's Orlando holding a massive 34 point lead to end the quarter. It hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. Whoa. Well, I'm John Brown. Am I going to buy a bicycle? I want to see no half Looking at the show. Eastern Conference, the prodigy leading the charge for this squad, man. Hey, Shaq, he's not only. But we have 80 and points a game. Back to our first half here. <laughs> Goes without shit. saying, a lot to like for the Orlando Magic. Glad you could join us. Ain't this? I got to make sure. This is, yeah, it's got to be on the hardest level. Not the hardest level, but I think Superstar is like right before Hall of Fame. And we're ready to get this second half of our Halloween broadcast going. Let me make sure. I don't think you can change the settings, though. No, you can't change the settings. We'll check out, though. I think you got super star, then you got... Shooting a sensational 78% from the field in this game. All right, time for an injury report. Bye, boy. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce to see how Wendell Carter's doing. Hi, guys. The head athletic trainer for the Magic provided some information. And unfortunately, this could yeah, be a season-altering injury. It's a tough way to start the season uh, for him and for the team, but they're optimistic that he can get back at some point. All right, that's good intel. We've definitely that's been stupid. thinking of him. And PG? now we have some more clarity, guys. Yeah, they now have all the information they need in order to determine the next steps. Everybody wishing the best for him. We Put all know how badly he Oh, you sorry, mother. Playing alongside his teammates and competing. George and Kawhi, the talented forward pair. Norman Powell out there with James Harden. And it's Plumley at the center position. Get out of here, man. In the second half for Ty Lue. Come on, bro. We trying to drop 100 tonight. Allie LaForce. Well, James Harden is not hating worried about already. his legacy. He said, quote, I'm going Watch to be remembered out. in basketball. I'm one of the people who changed the game. Oh, you, Honestly, you on the only now. thing I'm missing is a championship. But right, Brian, he is not stressing. He said, the moment I stop having fun, I'll be done. Yeah, march into the beat of his own drum, Allie. Thank you. Ah, dog, dog. Come on, dog. So he will go to the line. If they got that got them Kendrick from my braids. If I'm a young fan watching the NBA... Kawhi Leonard is a guy I'm keeping a close eye on, Grant. He does everything the right way. B.A., so much to like about Kawhi's game and how he carries Get himself. Up. He takes so much pride in what he does on both ends of the floor. See, this switch is tough. And if you're just joining us, we play just over a minute here in the third. Cross that mid-pick. Carter, a screen on George. Shot clock at six. Here's the prodigy. He's checked by Plumley. Damn. There's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over. I can't do it. I want that shot is going nowhere. Bid won't let me do it. I want that. Swat. Oh my God! And that was textbook defense, positioning himself well to send it back. Pardon. I'm trying to get the cheek. Oh, oh, oh! I ain't got no energy. I need to break. They need to give me. They need to put me on the bench. Yeah, but give me out, give me out, give me out the game, give me out the game, dog. 
You know, over his career, Paul George has racked up more than well, his give me out the game, bro. I'm tired. Well, he's a fixture at All-Star Weekend, that's for sure. Now, he's made the all-defensive team more than a few times. He's had... Bro, that's why I ain't going to hit my shot, bro. I'm tired. Look at the massive hauls that have been received in the trades with Paul George. That should tell you how valuable PG is. And it's stolen by... Bro, I'm tired. To the middle. Here's Leonard. <laughs> It's good. Well, Y'all got to get me out of the game, Coach. Contact. Hit the shot and we'll go right, to damn, the let's line. go get some Gatorade or something. Those 2014 NBA Finals featured tons of Hall of Famers. Tim Duncan, LeBron, D. Wade. And maybe the guy who was unintroduced but now introduced as one in Kawhi Leonard. Man, he just stole the show winning the series MVP. Don't shoot that. Did an unreal job on LeBron defensively. Shot 58% from three. What an all-time two-way performance, B.A. Really left him alone that Bruh, time. Bro, I need to get me out of the game, man. I'm points. tired. Yeah, 80 percent. Is that a good number from the field? I, I think so. Four or five here shooting. Terrific start. Carter, a screen on Leonard. Here's the prodigy. I can't shoot that shot, bro. I'm tired. Another miss by Orlando. Bad offense to begin the second half. Four misses right off the bat. All right, the I, I, I see what you're doing, coach. It's I see what you're doing, coach. Thus far, but they're trying to get back into the game. Orlando's got I see nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. He's putting the team right, on I his back. Don't. I see what you're doing, coach. Performance thus far. Right around three minutes into now. this second half. Now here's Harden. He's guarded closely. It's George on the wing. Tight shoot. From outside the arc. He missed. Harden misses. He's not the guy that you want to give a wide open look from three points. Oh, they are hard on me. Lucky that that one doesn't cost him. Here's the prodigy. I can't hit that shot, bro. I'm tired as a motherfucker. Uh, he was terrific in the first half, guys. Maybe some adjustments. They won't get you from Gatorade and that. Coach, and he's lost a little bit of that touch here in the second. Second half here, and we're just over three and a half minutes into it. Carter, a screen on Powell. The prodigy passes to Carter. Sweet little floater. Putting in work. Carter Wendell Jr. Carter. is a lunch pail guy who just goes about his business. Now Los he got me out here tired, man. I ain't got no energy. To four run. Plumlee, a screen on ben I ain't had a break the whole goddamn game. And then they... Now here's Powell. Outside Harden. There's the three. Sinks Fuck that. Let him score. Yeah, give me a break. Give me out well, the fucking game. The right path now, but still in a pretty big hole. Well, the run simply has given them a chance. Great work on both mm -hmm. ends. They've got to now ratchet up a notch. Russell Westbrook, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Look at my boy. Look, look y'all see, y'all see the blue. Y'all see that little bit, of, little bit of yellow. That's how my Just energy I got. From deep, and the three-pointer goes. And the ben coach Carroll's ain't pulled me out of the game yet, man. He, game. A, he a dirty he dude, man. He felt the defender closing out to him, and Ben Carroll let it fly. Bro, pull me out of the game, bro. I'm tired of it. Is a weapon. Here's Westbrook. Look at the Outside score, though. 72 to 47. I got 58 points. I wanted to drop 100, but the coach won't give me no, no Gatorade. On the wing. He's got 12. Good on the shot. He's hitting the George, shot. I can't 14. contest nothing. I'm just out here. Just out here. First half, some nice I get dunked, though. Well, <laughs> They're the right, man. They do me dirty out here, man. I mean, five of their we got a the coach. I'm going to get him fired, though. Don't worry about it. So they may need more production I'm tired of them. All right, I know I get a break now. I know I get a break. Looking at the 2K leaderboard. Here were the NBA's top dime droppers last year. James Harden, number one. Ain't no else in the game. It was a virtuoso performance. They ran the offense through him time and time again. I ain't playing with y'all, Nate. And you know, there's so much straight. coaching turnover in the NBA, Brent. Why do you think that is? There ain't no way I'm still in this game. Some of those changes. Well, look at the ownership changes that has happened. With I'm going to draw a sixth of a coach being released from his duties right, from a team. Something so real tired, these like. owners want to put into place maybe the style of play that they want from a different coach. I can't even get around this man. It's about I'm so results tired. And about those results being too Look at that. I can't hold a ball. a lot of change, and it, it makes that job a little bit more tenuous than it was in the past. And he yeah. was fouled. 
Caldwell in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. You know, when the Clippers first moved to L.A., people assumed they'd be second Tight fiddle shoot. to the Lakers. Not necessarily the case. Well, B.A., to, to be honest with you, they were for a long time, and then they moved into this building. There was a bit of awesome a shift. Awesome, motherfucker. See my little yellow boss, and that shit don't went away, season. man. They don't have the I'm out here on fumes at this point. tell you what, a powerful owner and a couple star players, that'll flip the faithful around for you, their offense sort of right now we just playing out Gatorade. See the little Gatorade thing by my name? On this. I can't hit a shot enough. I'm just out here. Harder with a screen. Here's the prodigy. It's Look at that. I can't hit even a thing. Come on, dog. Two for five from three since halftime. Down low. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Man, I don't know. We get the triple double down here. Basket. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Yeah, but yeah, I, have, I can't move on so slow. Wet. To Coach did me dirty tonight, boy. He did me dirty, boy. Pulls up at the elbow. The shot, no good. You won't see him miss I can't run down court. I'm too fucking tired. That happens. Important thing is for players just don't beat yourself up and make a miss like that. Look at that. My shit blinking like a motherfucker. The prodigy passes to Ben Carroll. Get back. Fuck it. Here's the prodigy. I can't do shit, man. With the yeah, foul. Give me out. And foul me. Give me out of the game. The scoring breakdown for the match. this shit. Bench me. Own the offensive perimeter throughout this game, finding lots of openings and turning them into big shots. And I feel like there's been a bad time. Damn. To what they've done tonight, and that is we should have watched this shit from the side, man. Dog. Getting it down low, getting those looks in close. That's been effective. And the Clippers making a change. What's y'all doing over there? Coffee's checked in. Isaac, he's checked in for Orlando. Bro, get off your phone, bro. He comes in for subs. He over here, Texas, is supposed to be working. Out. Look at them, Buffalo. They all on their phone. Fall. Look at dude over there in the tuxedo. He's supposed to be on his phone. He's supposed to be working. Y'all get off your phone, bro. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. We watching the game, dog. And the Clippers making a change here. Man's checked in. Well, fuck that shit. We finna get back in. We ain't standing that shit. Man. They just put me back in the game, bro. I ain't even, I ain't even got enough energy, dog. They just put me back in the game. And here's Anthony. He'll bring it up for Orlando. Fourth quarter. They just the foul. I'm gonna make y'all. Jonathan Isaac is foul. Maybe we're gonna work on these fouling badges. And it's Cole Anthony. And it's Franz Wagner. And it's the prodigy in at the three. And they've been so much more aggressive drawing the whistle here in the second half. Both good from the line Didn't that time. Brad, you had an incredible career. Two-time college champ, seven-time All-Star. But tell me what you're doing in your career resume. This is a blowout. You know, I shouldn't even be in this game. The, the main reason I wanted to open the door for other ex-players to get equity in teams, I do believe ownership groups should involve ex-players and listen to us. You know, And I think that is where the league is ultimately heading. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. I can't even hold the and ball in my hand, man. Magic. Magic. Orlando will retain Big goofy motherfucker. I ain't got no energy. Why am I even in the game? Bataze with a screen. Roll, 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 roll. Come on, dog, bro. Here's coffee. Pass to Westbrook. Here's man defended by Wagner. On the wing, man. OJ Hill. Zubats with a screen on. No Wagner. energy. Clock at six. Let's it go from 11. Not I can't the even run get the ball. Backcourt violation. And here's a look at what's coming up for the six turnover. Orlando Magic. On Thursday, Big they'll trade go up against the Jazz in Utah. Then on Saturday, they'll be matching up with LeBron James and the Los Angeles Lakers. Fuck it. Fourth quarter still some. young. Just over a minute play. Here's Bataze. Hit that shot. Uh oh, I got my energy back. You should be able to ask out the start from the You can wait, you can uh, sub out. Oh, I got my energy now, but you can sub out. Down this many points, you simply can't let him get that good of a look. Teachable. I didn't know you can sub out, but I'm just sending it in. Pass to George. I don't got my energy, though. I don't got whatever that uh little defense thing was. We back in here. We we back in here. Now give me the ball, bro. His first three of the half. Get y'all ass out the way. Nine total points from beyond the arc so far. We back in here. Oh, we hitting everything now. Look at that. 
And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. I didn't know you could go in the start menu and, and sub yourself out, though. Westbrook outside. All right, we got energy. Nice. Yes, George. Man, uh, and the 17 oh, shit. footer goes down. George has got 11 points here in the second half. George showing the I forgot about the ball movement shit. Get to the mid range. The prodigy. And good. There's oh, yeah. Another. Oh, he's been absolutely ridiculous in this game. BA, it feels like he can't miss. For three, George. Nah, George ain't like it's that. rebounded team. by Bataze. The Magic have gone a perfect three for three here in the fourth. Ah, oh, damn, that's all. The prodigy can't hit. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. And oh. take a trip to the line for two. Clearly got fouled on that shot. When you think about Paul George, still regarded as an elite two-way player, Brent. Yeah, you get that dynamic play on the offensive end where he's capable of 35 points any given night. But defensively, shutting down a team's perimeter all-star. I thought it would have crib a shoe. Fight air for a star player in this league. Harden, he's checked in for man. Here's the prodigy. The putback. Ooh. Controls the rebound and the putback. And really nice timing by Isaac on the glass. Winning himself a great second chance look. So they got the PG at the, the power four. Oh, right. That's it. By Isaac. Pass to the prodigy. Oh, you a superstar, G. Third minute of action now gone here. Good! Another from three. Hey. This is a historic shooting night for him. Tied for third now for most threes in a game. And the points keep oh, PG feeling, up. Feeling and the himself. keep dropping in. He is red hot from downtown. And with the new CBA, Brent, the league making things a little more challenging for the top team. Oh, that's a green. A chance to dig market teams. I nah, ain't playing with y'all niggas tonight, bro. They, 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 that shit dead. That loser shit dead, bro. If they think I'm finna get on the loot with them, bro, I'm good. I already play this shit here. You used to bolster a team that just needs. I can't do it with them motherfuckers this year. This off a season and put them. But that loot shit coming in and them niggas are coming in, bro. They, they okay with. Oh. Uh, they just want to quit the game and now nah, I'm straight bro y'all gonna y'all gonna do that bro I play. this one for three develop my play rebound by the magic the prodigy's got 13 rebounds in the game I need Glass to delete them of all my shit no That's good off the back of the rim but they straight with losing Harden. they okay they I being black pass to George there's the triple that's all. It's rebounded by Bataze. At this point, I'm not sure if it's the play calling or the player himself. Here's the prodigy. Pulls it. Oh, shit. I didn't see him right there. They get it back. Bataze. Great D that oh, time shit. from Zubats. We'll have a hard time shaking that one off. Perfect position. Plenty of space. Just I took too many L last season, but. Coffee. I don't took too many L or not. Even with like develop, developing these players and the but I read that Wagner. whole break shit and, and lose games. The rebound by the prodigy. Then to play with the niggas that I think is good. Struggling tonight. They need to find some other options out there to keep themselves in the game. His playmaking is something to watch. Threading that pass right in there. I might well get this triple double. Let me go and get three more assists. Harden against Wagner. Zubats with a screen on Wagner. Pass to George. He got a piece of it. Sure. Yeah, let me get this, sis. Here's the prodigy. Isaac with it. Oh, this thing go out of bounds, man. Come on, dog. For the Clippers, Leonard comes in for coffee. And it's man in for West. You fought me against me. They've done a great job of moving the ball tonight. Yeah, B.A., keeping everybody involved keeps everyone engaged. Pass to Leonard. Yes. Nice assist from Man, I was looking at that shit, but they got down streaming. And Leonard, a three-level score as well as an offensive anchor. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I be thinking these niggas be. <laughs> Man, this shit hit, boy. Here's the prodigy, George defending. Oh shit, that nigga got some big ass hand, man. Man, I'm telling you, bro, they would sell you. I, I'm not even gonna lie, bro. I've been, I've been enjoying playing low rec. 
I see why niggas play it because it's the skill gap is so <laughs> it's embarrassing, but the skill gap is so big that it's, it's just going in the, in the low rank and just ball out. And boy, you get on that damn. Uh, I think they say you hold. Like the hot. That's nice vision there. You see that pass. You make the feed before the defense has a chance to react, and that opens up he a ain't much on that. better opportunity to score. But when you get red, he said, "Yeah, oh yeah." On the wing man, here's the three. can't shoot, but if <laughs> the bitch go get them goddamn. Rebounds now. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close Damn, as the score says in a great win for the Magic. And you don't usually now. see this kind of blowout, but tonight they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never I've wavered seen it, in boy. their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. The low red. I like playing the low red, though. I see why people play get with the low red. Just twice. I think so it's good when you're developing deals. A lot but. to this team. And one player just stole the show tonight, doing everything for his team. A monster night for the prodigy. Oh shit! Just does a great job of looking for space right. and then finding it. That's if I had a lethal, <laughs> if I had a lethal spot, I lost the big now. Three. Orlando grabs the miss. I ain't mean pad that bitch. Too. Pass to the prodigy. Leonard with a double team up. down low. Ah, oh, he missed. Here's Get him. Go back down now. Back to Wagner. It's stolen. I was trying to say the screen. I had my icons up. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Nice shot by George. Two teammates connecting. Well, we right try to get up. Well, we didn't try to get I didn't try to get 100. No need to shoot. This one is done. Yes, they've got to be happy with tonight's effort. Watch me go with it. Nasty nigga. Here's the prodigy. Let's it go from deep. I'm tired, no bro. Luck on that one. <laughs> I ain't got no energy, man. They oh, busy got me in the game. This one easily to walk into enemy territory and deliver a performance like that. That says a lot about this squad. Blew their ass out the really water. Came in looking confident and didn't let yeah, man, they got that wreck shit. This boy. is what a dominant team looks like. And that wreck shit, but it, it had you frustrated. Broadcast. I ran with the squad tonight, though, so them boy like to win. We lost. I think we went two and one, three and one, some shit like that. Watching this 2K Sports presentation of the NBA. We'll see you next time. I learned don't don't bring out your good bills till you know you got a squad that you that want to win. How we did? How we did? We had the next attribute. So we can we can upgrade to uh ninety six, all right. That's all right though. What's that I mean? We had a ninety five. So I ain't I ain't moving him up to ninety. Man, so that's how I feel right now. I'm keeping him at ninety two. I ain't bumping him up until I get him to like purple. I'm up. I'm gonna get him to purple right now. He is silver. Once I get him the purple, just playing in the uh, just in the, the little bullshit red, I'm gonna just bump him up at one time. Right now we we could go up, but right now I got all the attributes I need though. Ninety five, yeah. I could put my steel all the way up, but right now we gonna we gonna ride this out. We gonna stay at ninety two. I see all I get is a uh, bronze intercept on that. So we good. Ain't no reason. We good. what we got. But anyway, man. Shit. Damn it, left thirty. Y'all let me. Y'all let me stream it late, man. You got a nigga up past his bedtime. God damn. All right, so should we back here tomorrow night? <laughs> Doing what we do. <laughs> sipping and streaming. That's what I need to call it. Uh, sipping paint. Sipping stream. But anyway, man. I appreciate y'all tuning in tonight. Uh, we, at, we almost at 
3,000, almost at 3,000 view, view hours, which is like a milestone, I think. But we almost at 3,000 view hours. So, everybody that tuned in, I, mean, I appreciate y'all for checking me out. But we back here, baby, streaming. Oh, we ain't doing no videos this week. We just streaming. We won't streaming hours this week. We ain't, uh, no sneaker view, no sneaker reviews, no tech reviews. We'd say that shit for next week. We trying to get 3,000 streaming hours. I think we had two. Let me see what that shit say. Ooh, 28, 27. We need 3,000 to partner up with YouTube. So, shit, y'all been here for the from the beginning. Shit, we we down there at the finish line. We ain't down there at the finish line. We at like the finish before start type shit. Cause you need 4,000 view hours. <laughs> you need 4,000 view hours and a thousand subscribers. To really like get into the AdSense program, but to be a member, you know, little shit like that, just to see if we even qualify, we need 3,000 watch hours. And we had 28.97, so streams is, I think streaming is better than putting up videos. Videos are more learn, long term. So like sneaker reviews, tech reviews, that's more, that shit that, that builds time over time, but streaming is right now, so it counts right now, so I think. Y'all tuning in, watching me stream and shit like that. That shit dope. Um, but yeah, sip and stream. That what we doing? Sip and stream. Cause that what that would be. We don't. Y'all ain't, ain't like y'all watching me do cartwheels or nothing like that. We just sitting here talking shit. Every now and then we might be in the little group chat and the boy be talking about little crazy shit. But we, that what we that what we do. Sip and stream. So I know y'all ain't here to watch me play basketball. Cause this shit here kind of be weak sometimes. But the fact that we just be here chopping it up, talking shit, talking about weird, crazy shit, you know. You don't know what this shit to turn into. But anyway, man, we got work in the morning. <laughs> it's 11.30. Oh, shit. I know. We tired of what. But anyway, man, I appreciate y'all tuning in. We gonna thug this shit out together. So anyway, man. I'm gonna holler at y'all to back. Same time, 7, 7.30, some shit like that. Everybody get settled in, man. But I'm out, man. Anyway.